Mr. Sandu. There is no alternative right now. Your wife requires an urgent surgery to remove the cancer of cells in her pancreas before they spread further. We have tried our best with chemotherapy. But as you can see, the cancer is still spreading. Doctor, what do we do? We make a deposit of 500,000 naira and we commence preparation for the surgery. 500,000 naira, doctor? Where do I get that kind of money? Doctor, please help me. You see, I, I don't have that kind of money. I have spent all I had because of this, my wife's illness. As a matter of fact, I'm owing. I've borrowed so much just to treat her. Please help me. Doctor, I'll spend this. Is there like an alternative? I mean, like an alternative treatment you can give to her? I tried other options, but there's no way we can continue with those ones. The real alternative is this one I'm telling you right now. The information I'm giving to you as regards that matter is just the final thing. You see, I have some patients to attend to inside. And I think all you need to know about this matter is what happened. I better to leave now. Let me let me check on that. I'm just sit by and watch her die. No, no, what no. What do we do? My wife will not die. I have to know that I must raise the money somehow. I must find the means. Dad, how? How do we raise the money? How do you raise the money? I have to go and see the chairman of our cooperative. We find a way. The last force. money you borrowed from the cooperative, you have not paid back. I know, but we can't give up. We can't give up. I'll just try. Let me go and see what I can do. But. Go and stay with your mother eh, before I come back. Eh? Please try to for me. I will, I will, my dear. Yeah, I'm here. Where is my father? Mm -hmm. That meant to get something. Yeah, Mama. I'm tired. I want your father to take me back home. Let me die there. Instead of wasting more money here. No. Nobody's dying. In fact, Dad went to get some money and he'll soon be back. So you see, nobody's going to die. There's no need, my daughter. Hmm? I have so far enough. And I've so far you people too. Let me just go home and die. Hmm? Mama, you're not suffering anybody. I mean, we are, we are not complaining. We, we are very happy taking care of you. And this is not your fault. Anyone can fall ill. So, we're not complaining. We're very happy taking care of you. Go and call the doctor for me. Let me tell him how I feel. Okay, mom. Let me quickly get the doctor. All about life is so deep. All about life is so wide. All about life is so mysterious. Be careful. All about life is so deep. All about life is so
Yeah, yeah, nothing. I, I'm waiting for the doctor. Mom said that she called the doctor that she wants to talk with him. Mm. Yes, yeah. and he stepped out, so I'm waiting for him to come back. Okay, I, I have all the money required for the treatment now. Dad. Yes, uh, how? 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 Uh, how did you raise the money? Uh, I have to sell the car. Dad, you sold your car? Uh, yes, now. My, my wife's life is more important to me than anything. To sell it to her. So, nothing. She just wanted to tell the doctor how to spin. Uh, okay. You just wait for the doctor here. Let me go and meet her. Huh? Okay. Tell the doctor that uh, I've gone to see her, okay? Okay, <laughs> now. Only I'm back. I have all the money required by the doctor to carry out the operation. Thank you, honey. But I want to go home. Why? Please don't talk like that. Eh? The doctor said you'll be fine as soon as he finishes the operation. Please, don't give up. Be strong for me. Be strong for us. Eh? Don't worry. Everything will be fine. I, I, I love you so much. And I will ensure that nothing happens to you. Okay? I love you too, honey. Yes. I love you too. Yes. 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 Mommy! 
Mommy! Mommy! Mommy! Wait, no, no, wait, no! Mom! Mommy! Mommy! No! Mommy! No! 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 What is it? Mama! Mom! Mom! Where is the doctor now? Ask me, let I just rest. Many years. Oh, did everything, chemotherapy, everything. Seven years, this. Seven. Mom, mom, she's in a better place. Just, just stop crying. You're making me feel really sad. She was like a mother to me. I know, I know, I know the whole story. Since I lost my mother, she's been there. I know the whole story. From Omugo to modeling advice. What do I run to again? Who do I run to? Oh, oh. Hey, Julian Agini, your son, do you are gone? Just like that, like a priest. Sorry, calm down. Mommy, calm down. Calm down. I am sorry. trying to calm down. Don't worry. Okay. Oh, calm down. Oh, I can't do this. Okay. Hey. I told you that your wife's sickness was not ordinary. Who's in a mili? Eh? She's from the water. It's the one you demily told me everything about her. Eh? Just a little sacrifice. She wouldn't have died. If you were not my sister, I would have asked you to leave my house this minute. I just lost my wife. And I am mourning her. Are you here 
to mourn with me or you are here to mock me. Tell me. What's wrong with you? Look at down. You would have mocked, walked me out of your house. Eh? Well, I have not come to mock you. Eh? I only came to tell you what you should know that you don't know. Or oh, are you killing me that you don't know? I... I'm telling you that I don't believe you. My wife died of cancer. And not by any deadly or any deity you're talking about. Hey! Memo, it's the one you didn't mean to look at. Hey! Me, I'm also from the same water. Yes, have you forgotten? When we were growing up, I used to fall sick quite often. Eh? Until our father did all the necessary things. It definitely would have taken me. I would have died by now. What would have put you alone? So have you stopped falling sick? No, answer me if you have stopped falling sick. You still get sick now and then. And have been responsible for your hospital treatment. Eh? Look, if Demelis uh, sacrifices or whatever you did to it are so effective, how come you were still falling sick? Eh? It would have healed you completely of those illnesses. So what are you talking about? What's on the Fugon if I want to make? Eh? If you go away, you're too stubborn and so doubtful. Eh? I, I am not stubborn. Yes, I'm only enlightened. Enlightened. Upanane lene noko osini ana arabman. The problem is that the people of this generation, they have abandoned the oracles and the deities. They were protecting the ancestors. Eh? They no longer care for them. Nobody is feeding them. And that is why they are reacting. Even eh, maybe. <laughs> the deities you are referring to, if they are hungry, they should go and hunt for food for themselves. Where do they live? Is it not in the forest? Can they look for their own food? Look, I just lost my wife and I am mourning. Allow me to mourn my wife in peace. Pico, okay me now. Anyway, I know you go going on. I'll be going back to the village tomorrow. I don't know what to do. I've lost a whole session in school. I mean, a whole academic session. You, like, that's a lot. I mean, a session is a lot. Should I just marry all these people, one of these suitors that are pestering me? Because I, I don't know what to do. No. My daughter is not going to get married until she finishes her education. And where will the money come from? You have just one session left. Don't worry. God will provide. I still have one plot of land at the outskirts of Lakey. I couldn't sell it when your mother was sick because there was no buyer. But now I have one. I will sell it and I will ensure that you complete your education. I don't know what to say that. I don't know what to say to you. But thank you. That was a promise I gave to you, my children that I will ensure that you complete your education to any level and I will keep to that promise. 
You see, when your mother's sickness became so bad, all your so-called suitors ran away. And that is why I want to advise you, my daughter. Gone are those days when women depend on men to survive. You are going to make sure that you bring yourself to a level where you can fend for yourself if and when the need arises. Times have changed. So you must be said to end it, okay? Very well. Thank you, Dad. No worries. When I think it's over When I think I've lost all That is when God says Whoa! This guy don't feel it Uchi 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 No, this is the thing Can't I enjoy myself? No I've been calling your name, you've been hearing me, you free to answer Okay, what is it? I'm going back to school. I need for you to give me your word that you take good care of Dad. He's lonely. He's stressed. Don't add to it, please. Tioma! Tioma! Sometimes I ask myself if really I'm your elder brother. The way you talk to me anyhow, like you are my mother, not even my kid sister. I'm simply advising you as your only sister to please take care of dad and not add to his pressure. Me, giving that pressure? Yes. You know the problem with you people here is that you have refused to embrace the truth. And I will keep saying the truth. Was I the one that made him poor? His mates, are they not governors, senators, billionaires and billionaires? What thing they do when they pop? No, 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 no. Do you know? Do you know if you ask me? Just I don't want to say it. Do you know that dad killed mom? Because there was no money. If money came on time, this woman would have survived. Some gratitude. Hey, graduate. That is because of him. There's food on the table, there's a roof over your head. That is dad. Show some gratitude, please. Chai. Chai! Tioma Chai! So this one now beans and uh, rice is food. Abi? Graduate for how many years now? As you show gratitude. You are so possible. You are possible. Tioma, you are possible. Abe, go and pack your load there. Go back to school. If you like, go there. And be doing this good girl, good girl, and fall into one Yahoo man or one idiot hand. Yes, I don't like people here now. I'll be following men. You want to pick up now, good girl. Jesus, stop! Come back to fire you. Oh, see, eh, I never knew that men can cook perfectly like this until I saw this boy's post. Look at him. Of course, mom. Don't you know that some men cook better than some women? Really? Of course. So why are your brothers not cooking? Uh, hmm? Maybe because you spoiled them. Excuse me, I never did. Okay, maybe they are lazy. They don't want to do it. They don't want to. <laughs> maybe they are lazy. <laughs> I love this cook. Oh, mm. let me take this cup. Hello, Chioma. You are welcome. <laughs> My dear, please manage it like that, huh? You know, things are very hard these days. You are my blood and I will always do what I can do to help. <laughs> Safe trip when leaving. And don't. Don't forget to give me a call when you get there. It's all right. Stay safe, eh? Bye. <laughs> that was Joma on the phone. She'll be going back to school tomorrow. Oh, that's nice. I like Joma a lot. She's very caring and she's a nice person. Yes. 
She is nice. Like her late mother of blessed memory. Oh. <laughs> I can't believe my sister is gone. I can't. That's alright. So, look at what he made. This one is um, African salad with a uh, sliced tomatoes and onions on top and garnished with oil bean. You know oil bean, Oba. You've given me a tip of what to cook tomorrow. That's my daughter. So when are we making this? Lunch or dinner? <laughs> do you know me? I said, do you know me? Hey, my name is Chief Doctor, Engineer Reverend Native Doctor, Chief Original Doctor, Clifford Okurora, aka Okwan Madakanaya. Oh, my God, That is a break news. A breaking news. I want you to stay tuned. Don't move. Because I have an update. I'm going to feed you with the update. Uh, I'm going to feed you with every news that is happening in this city. If you move, I move you. If you talk, I'll talk you. If you kick, I'll kick you. Eh, Clifford, Clifford. <laughs> See? I don't Main man's house, eh? the first son and legitimate bona fide first son's house. So anything you want is for you. You're coming, you understand? Call me Josh, baby. baby. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, sugar. House is so beautiful. Thank you. It's yeah. it's yours, baby. <laughs> Let's go. Of course. Of course. Let's go inside. Lock the gates. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Oh. Do you like it? Oh, yeah. wow. You like it? I love it. I know you will, Shinger. Your house is so beautiful. Yeah, this is Josh's house. 
Like you said, bona fide and legitimate friends are on the fact. So whatever you want, just say it. You should be telling me about your first step. <laughs> yes, baby. Now let's turn this house upside down. Let's turn it blue, red, white. Let's stay. And pink. Yes, baby. <laughs> Ooh. Um. Whatever it is you want, Six, they will bring it for you. You are in Josh's house, okay? <laughs> Even if you want a car, I will buy you a car. You buy me a car? Yes! Oh my god! Maybe uh, you buy me a car? Yes, of course, baby! Oh, come, come here! <laughs> Can you buy me a car? Oh my god, I can't wait to be a car owner! You won't kill me! You won't kill me! <laughs> <laughs> from daddy you still go ahead to bring a girl into the house uh, no, no I, 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 your papa... it's okay she's so terrible <laughs> what was that hey. problem serious problem i don't know why she came back so early hey <laughs> let's finish what we started hey, hey, no 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 hey. you have to come away you put me in trouble so in this house eh we don't do this kind of things here when she said, after all the warnings. My lord, wait, wait, wait. Baby. Baby. No, 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 okay. Please she don't touch please. me. It's okay. It's okay. Girl is just a small girl. I'll take care of you now. Eh?
Yes. Sit down. You're not going to tell dad and mom what you saw today, will you? Of course I will. Why are you disrespecting us like this? This is the third time you're doing this and I've covered you so many times. I can't anymore. Well, I don't blame you. You're still a very small girl. By the time you get matured, you will understand how this thing works. Hmm? Lies. He's a maker not grown up. Why is he not behaving like you? Your junior brother, yet he behaves so responsible and more mature than you. Are you mad? Eh? Is, is something wrong with you? Hmm. Hmm. I said, hmm. Is, is it because I, I didn't wake up this lab? How dare you compare me and that fool, Emeka? Why not? Everybody knows Emeka is better than you. <laughs> I slap you. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. I've taken enough of your insults. Now let me warn you. Let you get me the first and the last time you will ever compare me and that nonentity in this house. If you try it again, if you try it, what I will do to you, you will not like it. Then you should respect your. <laughs> Sorry I shouted at you. Alright? Like I said, you're still a small girl. You don't you don't really know how these things work. But you will as time goes on. Okay? I want you to know whatever you want, whatever it is you want me to buy for you, I will do it. But you must promise me. Promise me you won't tell mom and dad what happened here today. Promise you what? Of course I'll tell them. This nonsense has to stop. Excuse me. Ada! Ada! I told you before, my name is Obi now. I just came back from the UK after my studies. So I'm trying to open an ICT business here in the country. Oh, that's nice. It's mm. nice. Oh, all right, now you're home. Um, do you mind we go for lunch? Um, no, I can't do lunch with you. Like I told you, I need to see my dad and I'm actually dating somebody now, so it just will not be proper. Okay, because I still want, I, I'm new here, I don't have a friend. Anyways, no problem. Um, it's alright, let me give you my card. Uh, yeah, okay. Have it. Have it, feel free to call me in case you change your mind. 
I'm not changing my mind about getting married, but because thank you very time. much. Because we must still be friends. Hmm? Thank you for the ride. All right, you're welcome. You're welcome. Thank you. Hey! You're welcome. Thank you, Daddy. Oh, I'm glad you made it. Finally. Congratulations. Thank you. Finally you made it. Yes, and it's all thanks to you. Thank you so much, Daddy. You did everything. You broke a leg to ensure that I got here today, and I'm so thankful. What is my work? No, what is my duty as a father? Look, I promised myself that every single child of mine must attain the highest level of education that he or she desires. Yes, you, you know, did. don't mind this rough time that uh, came in and all no, that. No, 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 you did great. You know? And I'm so thankful. Really, I am. Oh, you're welcome. Thank you. You see, you made a very long journey. So you need to rest. Yes, I did. Go inside. Thank you. Where did you came? He went out um, for an interview. There he is. Ah. <laughs> Uje! Who am I? I'm back! I beg you! Nice to see you! Same here! Look at you! Me what? You're looking good! Ah, this school favor you! I'm looking good! You're looking trim! Look at you now! Yeah, that's right! Look at, look at how trim you are! I'm looking good! I swear, I swear you are looking good! After all the stress, I'm looking good! Mm, that stress is good though! Me, I need that kind of stress! Where are you coming from? Hmm. My sister. Job interview, again. I'll get back to you. I'll get back to you. But they will never do. The big men in our society have cornered the jobs for their sons, their friends or their relatives. It's sad. My dear. You know now, I've tried to start up at least something for myself, a business. No way. I've searched for job for everywhere for more than two, three years now. Nowhere. They will ask, who recommended me? Or do I have five years experience where will i get that experience from what's in school you have to take it easy things will fall into place with time. fall into place where there is nothing falling into place for poor people like us in this country again you know? everybody to fight for themselves i have tried getting a job for myself for how many years now no funds papa no gets now back home. i went to the bank for funds, at least loans, to start my business. For where? The boss will ask you, where is your landed property or house? Will I build house while it's school? My sister. Everything is frustrating. Anyway, anyway. Uche, Uche. Enough of these stories of war, please. Huh? Ah, look, let me tell you. We need to just do the right thing. Okay? When we continue to do the right thing, God will bless our household with success. Alright? So let's not uh, badger with uh, all these stories. Baba when he... <laughs> Did he bless you? Did he bless your own household? I beg, uh, Chichi, what did you bring for me? I didn't buy anything. Mm -hmm. No, 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 don't say that. There's nothing in my bag. Mm -hmm. Don't say that. Yes, you can't say it. Ah, you are. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> what are you?
ada 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 uh, yes let's go I I want you to help me do something. Take this money. Help me buy a charge card. 500. Then use the money 500 to buy whatever you want. I'll just buy you airtime. I don't want anything. Yes, I she just stepped out. Right now. Yes, do the need for. Friendly. Hi, Joshua. Yes, he's around. Uh, okay, please, guys, it's still a secret. I want you to have it. Let me tell you, just help me to tell him that. What is the meaning of this? What, Pamela? Meaning of what? Just it's a secret that I want you to hear me. I lost. Okay, but you know what? I will see you later. Yeah? You'll be there. I will see you. Ada, Ada. See you. Bye. I don't get it. Stop me, photo! Stop me, photo! Hey, snap you, photo! That photo will put you into trouble. If you snap with me, no problem. Snap me. <laughs> no problem. I don't have problem. Very soon, you people will hear from me. All the secrets will be open. By who? By who? By who? By who? By click, click, click for <laughs> <laughs> what kept you so long? Nothing. The woman, she was... Hey, hey, hey. Don't bother. I already know what kept you this long. So, Ada, at your age, you know, now go about hanging around boys. What? What do you mean, what? If, 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 you, if you ask me that question again, if I slap you, all your teeth will fall down. What are you talking about? What I'm talking about. So, all you do now is go about kissing and hugging boys outside, in public, on the streets. Stop it, brother. Ah, what do you mean, stop what? You didn't what? do anything. Now. You did what? You didn't do what? So I'm just blabbing. I'm talking rubbish. Okay, wait. 
Did you do anything after such? Stop it! Stop it! You're doing like at warm. Wait. Mm -hmm. You didn't do anything. You, you be shaking like maggots. You didn't do anything. We we'll see the evidence now. And now what is this? Oh my word! Your what? Eh, which word? You don't have any word here because you, if, if, I, if I if I what is this? What is this? Are you, are you asking me? I should be asking you that question. No, I didn't do anything. You didn't do anything. No. So this is just Photoshop, right? No. You, eh, eh, if you talk, if you talk again, now if you must know. A good Samaritan sent these pictures to me and said we should caution you, warn you to stop doing all this because you're too small for this. Brother, you know, it's that time I was coming back from buying uh -huh. and Tony stopped me and did And you guys held yourself and kissing yourself no. so closely in public no, no. on the streets. No, it's not true. It's not true. Yes. It's okay, no problem. Let yes. mommy and daddy come back. Hmm? Yes. When they come back, no, no, now please, brother, please don't tell them anything. I don't do anything. I know, I know, I'm not dear. I, I don't do anything. Oh, I should not tell them. Hey, we. So I should not tell them. But you will want to tell them what I did. But I should not tell them what you did. I will not tell them, I promise. You will not. Yes. You will not. Yes. Okay, no problem. <laughs> hey. Mm. At your age, you're still do, you're doing all these things. No problem. <laughs> Brenda, no, please. I promise I will not tell them. You I promise? Said. Yes. Okay. Yes, please. Please, please now, brother, please. I will not tell them, please. please. It's okay. Stop crying. Let's make a deal. Hmm? You will not tell them what I did. And I will not tell them what you did. Yes. Deal? Deal. Deal? Deal? deal. deal. How many times did I ask you? Three deals. Three deals? Yes. Okay, no problem. <laughs> Thank you, bro. Uh, uh, wait, no, wait, no, wait, no, wait, no, come, come back here. Hey, wait. You want to go out? Have I finished with you? I was going to the room. Wait, kneel down. Kneel down now. Now listen. Anything I tell you to do now, you'll be doing it very fast. Are you hearing me? Now you will go to the kitchen. Prepare noodles for me. Hot one. Hmm? You will make sure that all the ingredients are inside. Pepper, carrot, cabbage, even a, 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 a hot dog. If there is no one in this house, you can't look for it and put it inside. Are you hearing me? Mm. Now get out. Hurry! Small girl. This is what happens to you know, that means the duties are better business. What will I do with this card now? Eh? Let me call Tony and send it to him. This is useless to me. Can you imagine? <laughs> Tonero! Joshua, my man, what's up? <laughs> you bad boy. <laughs> bad guy. What's up now? It's not a bad boy. See, respect yourself. Don't be that kind of to my sister again. Abby, I told you that I would deliver. <laughs> I told you. <laughs> okay, wait. I'm going to send you the card you went to buy. Mm -hmm. So that you use it. Load it in your phone. Eh? Where everything worked out perfectly. Uh, Anyway, no problem. No Allah, no Allah. Uh, later now, let's meet at uh, one child's place. Remember what you promised me, oh. He says, um... You need to see the way you're shaking. <laughs> I, I'll call you later, I'll call you later. Hi! So good. Hey!
and wherever you are, you can hear me. But if you see me, good news. I'm done with school. Just like God promised he did everything. Everything humanly possible to ensure that he finished. Now we here. But you're not here. And you can't see me. Or maybe you can't. And I'm hoping that you are proud of me. I'm very happy. I miss you. I miss you so much. What? <laughs> Good news again. Your baby girl is getting married. And his name is Afa. Afa Mifuna. A gentleman. And somebody I know you would have loved. You are so wicked, inevitable. I have seen and believed. You have taken away the jewel of my heart. After much suffering, that you took away my mind. Very, very angry with you. Very, very. I've been coming down. I've been coming down. You're angry with mm -mm. me? Why did you not tell Afam, your husband to be, what you discuss as requested? Uchi, I told you things do not work that way. Mm. I can't be discussing that with somebody I just met, telling him he wants to travel abroad. Eh. Someone I just met. You cannot be discussing that. So why are you waiting? No, what are you waiting for? Why not? Why don't you discuss it with him? He's our in-law, our in-law to be. This is part of his responsibilities. Just a little patience, Uchi. I cannot be discussing that with a man that I just met. I don't even... Why, just... why would you? Why would you discuss with him? Don't you see him one-on-one? -on -one? Why did you not discuss what we discuss as brother and a sister? together in this house. You agreed you would tell him before he went back to America. Did you not see him before he left? Would you please excuse me? No, no. He's not excusing you anything now. You must hear what I'm telling you because you are very selfish. I've told you, my sister. You are very, very selfish. All my friends, they are in-laws, took them abroad, and they are doing very well. Me, every day, I carry fire. Jangoro, I've been walking from one office to the other, and they are insulting me. Patience is a virtue. You have to calm down. Things will fall into place. Things just can't work because you want them to work like now, now, now. It's... Things don't... Have you seen the selfishness? Grandfather, you're sounding like him. Look at you. You are advising me now as a senior sister. My younger sister, me. You are not advising me as a senior sister. Hey, it's my own fault now. It's me. Ha! Uche, oh, Uche, you are useless. Uche, you know, get sense. Why? Did I even discuss this with this, my sister? I would have told the man myself. I go tell her fam, anything that will happen, let it happen. Selfish sister. Don't worry. I'll come with you now. Hey! Ah, Uche. Uche, it's going to do.
Oh, my baby. How are you? When did you get in? I just got back from London a few hours ago, so... I wasn't expecting you. I know, but I said, let me come and meet you. What is it that I'm hearing? Huh? What? That you're getting married? Yes, I'm getting married. I don't get it. What about me? What, 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 what about you? Well, I made my intentions clear to you that I will get married to you. Eh? Jerry, you were not serious. So I'm getting married to our fam. And oh. that is it. Oh, really? I, I do not understand. Is it because uh, you came back from abroad? Eh? I'm a more traveled person than him. Eh? Do not worry. We can cancel everything. All right? Jerry, Whatever they ask I do not have it. time for this kind of talk. I have somewhere very important I need to get to. What is going on? What did he give to you? Huh? Let's cancel everything. Whatever thing I will pay. I've, I've, I've been to Thailand. I've been to... Your the... manipulations no longer work with me. I told you I have somewhere very important I need to get to. Uh, Choma, don't do this to me, please. Right? You are the one I want to make my wife. What is going on? I came back all the way from London to see you. I, I, I've been to Thailand. I've got uh, Thailand back. I've got uh, Cambodia real. I've got Indonesia Rupia. What is your problem? Huh? Tell him, let's cancel everything. I will pay. My son, you don't even show concern. After everything I did for you. Oh, Mama, what do you want me to do? Huh? You want me to sit here with you, doing nothing? No, I have to hustle, I'm a man. Huh? I'm a man, I have to go and find something to it. <laughs> Jerry. <laughs> Jerry, I loved you. I bumped you as a child. It, 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 it is my turn for you to show love and care. You abandoned me. Jerry, look at how you are treating me like a piece of rag. Um, mother, leave that matter. I came all the way from the States, United States of America, to, 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 to see you, right? It's not easy at all. It's not easy. Like I said, I will send some money and I will get someone mature enough to take care of you. You know, go, right? Jerry. Jerry, you always make promises that you cannot keep. Jerry, where have I wronged you? What have I done to you? Uh, mother, uh, please listen. I am not in for this nagging. You always nag. What do you want me to do? Huh? You'll be fine by God's grace. Okay? You'll be fine. Nothing will happen to you. And I will get someone, like I promised you, I will get someone that will take care of you. Okay? I, I have some things that I need to attend to uh, because I have limited time to stay here in this country. So do not worry yourself. I, I'll, I'll sort it out. Okay? I have to leave now. Huh? I'll, 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 I'll talk to you later. Mama, it's okay. Oh. Mama, oh. it's okay. Oh. 
look at what my son look at how he's treating me. I loved him. I pampered him. No. Mama, stop crying. It will be fine. Obina, you want to come and eat? You are a lazy boy. You want to come and eat food, but ordinary plantain you cannot sell. You, you cannot sell, Obina. Auntie, I sold everything. It's only only what? Shut up your stupid mouth. Since the morning, no. Since the morning, Obina. Since the morning, Obina. Since the morning, Obina. Obina, since the morning. Hi! It, it's because... It's because of be what? Um, Hi! Abina! Look at this food! So your eyes are feeling the food. You want to eat food. Abina, you want to... Abina, you want to eat me! Abina, you want to eat me! Abina, you want to eat me! Oh my God! <laughs> You are a very wicked boy! You are a wicked boy! You are wicked! Abina, you are, you are a fool! Idiot! Hey. Obina, Obina, I, 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 just, I just feel like struggling you! You deserve it! You want me to come and fry this food so that you can eat it? Oh, oh my! Eat, 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 eat. You're not taking the meat. Oh yeah, eat, 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 eat. eat. Don't worry. I'll teach you a lesson. Wickedness does not Don't worry. pay. I'm sorry. It's okay. But has a way to bounce back. Huh. Better think twice before you do. Cause God is our way of everything. Oh. All about life is so deep. All about life is so I loved and pampered him. I gave him all I worked for. I must stop crying. <sighs> I don't understand. What are you doing? I told you I'm about to get married. I need for you to stop coming here. Nothing can happen between us. After all, I invested in you. What did you invest? Please remind me. Like you fed me since I was born, trained me all through school. What, what, what did you invest? No. Oh. Huh. So, you've forgotten so soon, right? That I used to send you money from abroad. $200? You really want us to discuss two hundred dollars? Um, um, it's okay. Can you stop about coming it. into my father's house and acting like something is happening? Because if Afam ever meets you here, I don't have any explanation for him. You have to stop. Um, it's okay. Hmm? It's fine. You win. Thank you. It's okay. What's so much? I'm fine.
Jerry. You sold it. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm uh, oh, hey. out. I'll call you, right? Continue, Mama. Hey. You sold everything that my husband worked for. You left me with nothing. Now I am sick. I'm not about that, Sharon. Please. I hate it when you talk like this. Right? Why do you keep reminding me of things I've forgotten in my life? Why? Eh? I, I don't like it. Please. Do you want me to go uh, uh, forward or backwards? Jerry. How can you go forward like this? You sold everything my late husband worked for. You sold everything and escaped abroad. You left me with nothing. Even the little one I had. People you defrauded came and collected all of them. Um, mother, now you're making me angry. I am not happy. Eh? You are making me angry. I am your son. I'm trying my best to make you well and happy. But you want to ruin everything. You want to ruin it when you come up with these uh, cock and bull stories. I am not telling you Kokampu's story. I am telling you the truth. Mm -hmm. Jerry, mm -hmm. I made a lot of mistakes in my life. Mm -hmm. That is what I'm suffering. Mm -hmm. My son, mm -hmm. I don't want you to suffer the same. Mm -hmm. I don't want you to suffer. <laughs> Please, I want you to change your ways. Okay. Please, my son. I will. I have heard you. Huh? Don't worry yourself. You are the only mother I have in this uh, wicked world. I will take care of you. I have arrangements, right? You will like it. I have arrangements. I will bring someone that will be mature enough to take care of you. Someone that will pamper you. You pampered me, huh? Don't worry, I have some plans. I'll bring someone. Someone that knows how to take care of older women like you. Huh? She will take care of you. And you're gonna like it, right? Don't worry, don't stress me. Eh? I'll get someone that will take care of you. Okay? Don't worry yourself. I'll have to go now. Let me, let me, let me. Abigail! Sure. Abigail! Mother, tell me, tell me, tell me. Take this money. Huh? Take good care of her. Get her everything she wants until I get someone that will take care of her properly. Right? Don't worry. I'll have to leave, Mama. I don't want to miss my flight. Okay? I've heard what you said and I will change. Let me leave. Sorry. Jerry. Oh? Uh -huh. Jerry. 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 <laughs> Mama, stop crying. It's okay. You'll be fine. Look at me. Through your hand, your legs. Do quick.
Since I left this house, huh? I have I have finished washing the clothes, so I'll still be done with the plates. <laughs> eh? You have finished washing the clothes, and you will soon be done with the plates, eh? Since I left this house, Obina, you are playing, Obina. Why are wash? Have I not warned you not to call me in my game? How many times? Oh yeah, watch, watch this place! Watch it! Watch it! Stupid boy! I'm sorry, ma- hey, 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 shut up! Sorry, you said I'm sorry. Oh my god. This boy is just- You're just playing with me. No, what no. Do I in any way- Oh my goodness. Do I in any way look no, like your mother? No, no ma. And why are you calling me ma? Yeah. Okay. Shut up! Oh hey. yeah, watch! Watch! Wash! I said wash! Wash! Do this thing fast to come and go to school! Look at this boy! I said wash! I'll be that wash! Wash! Okay, let me go and come back and see, see you washing this place. You see what I'll do to you! Stupid boy! Wickedness! Don't worry, let me come back here again. I'll still see you wash that place. You see what I'll do to you. But has a way. To bounce back, can I think twice? Before you do, cause God is our way of everything. All about life is so deep. All about life is so So deadly, you might think you've made it through, never offend the innocent, because God knows the best way to fight back, oh. Auntie, I'm ready for school. Uh -huh. If you are ready for school, go now. My, my food. Bina, which food? Obina, 
Which food? Which food do you want to eat? How much did you get from the orange I gave you yesterday? And then you want to eat food? Get out of my sight. But I'm hungry. I went to bed hungry and now I haven't eaten. I, I washed the plate and also the coat. I'm hungry. <sighs> I've heard you. You are hungry. You went to bed without eating. This morning, you are hungry. Obina, go outside. Go to the streets. Use that bell that you people are using in the school. Go and announce to them that yesterday you did not eat anything. You, you slept hungry. And this morning, you... Obina, you stubborn goat. Is this stubbornness that killed your mother? Obina, you want to use me, Matilda, to practice that the same stubbornness that killed your mother? <laughs> Obina, you will pay for this. For this insult! Before, go to school. When you come back, you see. Food, I'm hungry. I need to eat. <laughs> hey, Mati! For me, Henebino. You are hungry, you want to eat. Then come and eat me. Obina, come and eat me. You look at your face. Only for get to chin ebo bere one. On a merry gebere. You want somebody to pamper you. You want me to pamper you. Then if you want it, go outside and look for your mother. I said, go out and look for your mother so that your mother will come and pamper you. And I did not look like your mother, and I cannot be like your mother. Wickedness does not pay, but has a way to bounce back. But I think Nay, Obina, Obina, Obina. Obina, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I treated you badly. How would I have known that my own son, whom I loved and the pampered, would turn out to be my tormentor? Obina. Obina, forgive me wherever you are. Forgive me. It's okay. Stop thinking. You're making your sickness worse. Yeah, I'm even tired.
is not going through. It's pressure. He might not even know where he dropped it for. Or maybe his phone went up because of too many calls. Exactly. I think you're putting pins here. Yeah, oh yes, yes. It's stupid. Yeah. It's just unusual. I mean, him and I have been talking in the last 30 minutes and then all of a sudden his phone goes off. He will call back. Just calm down. Hello? What? Who, who, who are, uh, So please excuse me, but you should leave. No. Just go, go out. Go no, out. Are, why are you asking them to leave? They're dressing me up. Let them just leave first. I won't talk to you. I said leave your what? Just leave, leave your box there. Go! What is your problem? What's going on? We're already late and then you're asking them to leave. See. <sighs> then what's going on? I am just called. He said he's no longer interested in going ahead with the wedding. What? What? What did you say? He gave no reasons. He just said he's no longer interested then. Uh, as I wanted to talk, 
He didn't allow me to say anything. He no, just wait, called wait, me. I, wait, what? 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 Wait, no. What? What, calm down. what are you saying? Calm down. We'll sort it out. Just, just calm down. Dad, wait, wait, no. Wait. You, you have to calm down. What are you saying? What? What is going on? Huh? What? 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 What is it? Is it you what I'm hearing? What are you hearing? About the wedding. Which wedding are you talking about? Someone said that she overheard Uchi talking to someone on the phone. Mm -hmm. That the wedding has been cancelled. What sort of rubbish is that? What do you mean the wedding is cancelled? This is too much to do. What? What kind of job is that? Sweetheart, honestly, I can't comprehend this anymore. My sister couldn't hurt a fly. So she died after so much effort to save her life. And now Choma is humiliated like this. Why? Don't go. So that it's okay. <gasps> it's okay. Choma is a strong girl. She'll get over this. I hmm? just hope so. She will. I hope so. She is heartbroken. Choma doesn't deserve this at all. She doesn't deserve all this. Sweetheart, people do not always deserve what they get in this life. This is a reality we have to live with. And you know it. Huh? Eh? Please, please, calm down. Hmm? Calm down. I'm not happy seeing you in this mood since after this incident. I believe that something is wrong somewhere. This is no longer ordinary. I need to see my pastor. I need to see my pastor first thing tomorrow morning. I need to see my pastor. If you ask me, I'll, I'll tell you those things are not necessary. You see, once you start digging, you, you get yourself into more confusion. Yes. Choma is a strong girl. Like I told you, she will get over this. She's smart. She's hardworking. And everything, she's beautiful. Better people will come. It's just a matter of time. Forget about this pastor things. It doesn't... Uh... Sweetheart, I know you don't believe. But things are happening. This is not ordinary. How can we be jumping from one problem to the other? I believe that this is a spiritual attack. I need to do something about it before it gets out of hand. I need to see my pastor. I need to see my pastor. It's okay. It's alright. It's alright. It's alright. Right. Why would this happen to her? Why? The more you mourn, the more I'm affected. Too, huh? I am heartbroken oh, too. I know my sister will be turning in her grave. Shoma will get a better husband in time. Every problem has an expiry date. And time is the greatest healer. Okay. I need to see to see my pastor. I am feeling for Choma. I know that my sister will be torn in her grave. Oh. It's okay. Choma will be fine. Oh. Choma will be fine. Better men will come. She'll get married and be happy. Mm? Things like this. People are abandoned at the altar. Yes, but at least, see, for me, it's, 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 God has a way of arranging these things. When the man that is not her man, let him go. Better one will come. When the real man comes, you will confess, you will remember today that I said so. Hmm? It's alright. 
Come on, come on. It's okay. Joshua. Joshua. Yes, sir. Come here. Good evening. And where have you been since morning? Oh, I... I went out with my friends. Which friends? Which of them? Uh, my friends, Dad. And what have you been doing with those your friends since morning? Check out the time. Uh, yes, uh, we are... Um, we are actually studying for the jam exams. Jam? Yes, Dad. Joshua, this is the third time you are preparing for jam. Third year you are taking jam. And the story is the same thing. The last time you scored 80, 80, over 400. Why your younger brother scored 285. 285. You scored 80. Now you started again. Oh, oh, Josh. Oh. When are you going to get serious with life? When are you going to take life serious? Dad, I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm trying. Yes. Oh, come on, Dad. I'm, I'm studying very hard. Like, you know, as a first son, bona fide and legitimate first son of his family, I have decided to be a breed, study hard and be a medical doctor. Yes, so that I can actually make this family proud, make you my father proud, not any other person. Medical doctor? Yes, Dad. Hmm, that's wonderful. That's really wonderful. But I remember the last time you told me you wanted to be a pilot. Yes. Uh, yes, I have but um, I, actually I, I, I changed my mind. Oh. Uh, yes, you know, like I said, being the first son, I thought about it. Who cares about being a pilot? But when you come out and you say, okay, this family, they've got a doctor, the best medical doctor in this. And mind you that, I have the sole intention of building the biggest hospital, specialist hospital in this city. So when I'm a renowned medical doctor, it actually gives more feathers to the camps of this family. So that's why I decided to change my mind from being a pilot to become a medical doctor. So. Wonderful. Yes. Mm. Best medical doctor. Yes. Best. Biggest hospital, huh? Yes, that. In this city. Yes, biggest hospital. Wonderful. Yes, that. You. You, Joshua. That's the problem. Dad, you keep downgrading you did you keep demoralizing me this is not fair yeah? then give me some accolade encourage me for once like this is your first son bona fide and legitimate first son of the family come on dad when you do these things it actually kills my spirit how do you expect me to strive? how do you expect me to read and you know as a medical doctor I'm actually supposed to be having a lot of chemicals in my head o2 plus o with h o2 and the way they balance the equations if I do this, I cannot, I can't be able to, to read very well. Yeah, you are complaining I had a score 80. These are the things that actually kills my spirit. Encourage me. It's okay, it's okay. You, you want me to believe you, eh? Yes, Dad, come and on. And encourage you, eh? Yes. To be a medical doctor. Medical doctor with the biggest hospital. Wow. Yes, I, you know, I'm actually, I was actually thinking of the name I'm going to. The name won't be a problem. Joshua biggest hospital. No, 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 that, that has to local now. We're not in a local dispensation. This is, I mean, this is a big family that I've forgotten. Here's something that's touched, polished. Josh the Lafay Specialist Hospital. Or Josh the, something like that. I'll think about it and wow. something that I'll coin, I'll make it make sense. That's wonderful. Yes. That's wonderful. <laughs> With 80 in jam. <laughs> it's okay, I believe you. You can go. Yeah, you can go. All right, Dad. <laughs> Joshua, from pilot to medical doctor. Tomorrow you tell me you want to be an engineer. 
and then he would end up uh, a mechanic. I threw money in there, my camera. Hey, there is a problem. I knew it. I knew it right from the beginning. That there was a problem somewhere. How could a beautiful girl like Chioma, a girl with wonderful character, be abandoned by a man just like that? How could it happen? Has this ever happened in our family? It has never happened. Hmm. That is why before I started coming, I had to visit as a one of the mini. I consulted her to know what happened. And she revealed everything. Everything about your daughter Chioma. So, what did she say? Hmm. Osondo, from the look on your face, <laughs> you're already showing doubts. And that is the problem. If you knew I was going to doubt you. Why did you bring the matter up? Why? Hmm. Anyway, it will only be my fault if I don't deliver my message. Eh? I will tell you exactly what Ezewan said. If you like, accept it. If you don't like, keep it, drop it. It's okay. I'm listening. As the one I need, Mili said that there are people in our village that used some dark and ugly clothes to cover Chioma's face. Spiritually dark and ugly clothes to cover her face so that no man will see her and like her. Any man that looks on her face gets scared. The next thing, he run away. But she said there is a solution. A small sacrifice is required. So, she said a white goat is required. Yes, a white he goat. Me? Eh? With a, 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 a black stripe by the side of its face. That's all. But the problem is this. Chioma, Chioma's presence is needed in the village for this sacrifice to take place. I don't know if you allow her to come. I'm not going to go to the I want to thank you so very much for your concern and effort. But I must tell you, my daughter has no problem. And my daughter is not going anywhere. As a matter of fact, we've had cases of brides being abandoned at the altar. But they didn't die. They survived and they moved on. So please, leave my daughter alone. Biko. Ah. Osondo. Yes. Osondo. That is my name. Osondo. It's my name again. How many times did I call? Three. If she does not do this sacrifice, it will happen again. And I reject it for my daughter. What is it? I reject it. Look, my daughter is young. She has no reason whatsoever to be desperate. She's a graduate. Very soon she will get a good job and she will move on with her life. What are you talking about? At the right time, God will provide a man of her dreams for her so just leave her alone okay she'll be fine she's in her father's house what is this huh? so what are you saying are you doing this sacrifice or not oh have you suddenly turned deaf have i been bleeding no tell me look let me tell you my daughter is not doing any sacrifice. 
my daughter will not see any Ezewain or uh, Idemili or prophet or seer. She's okay. She's in her father's house. This is lovely. <laughs> Thank you. See that? I've seen it. It is all through. I've seen it, honey. Wonderful. I've seen it. In your first year, you registered A is all through. And then second year, done and dusted, you're also leading the class with A's. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Congratulations. Thank you. Oh, Congratulations, I'm so proud my of dear. You. Congrats. I'm so proud of you. Congrats. Wonderful. It's every parent's dream to see their children make the best of opportunities presented to them. What you sow is what you reap. When you study, you get good results. When you don't study, you don't get good results. No two ways about it. Hmm? This is wonderful. Congrats. Thank you, Dad. <laughs> so by next um, semester, you will be in the third year. Yes, Dad. Wonderful. And I will make you proud again. Oh, as <laughs> always. Thank you. Thank you. I owe you a gift. A gift? Yes. Wow. I won't tell you what it is, but surely wow. I'll get you a gift. I can't wait to see I it. I must continue to encourage your brilliance and your commitment <laughs> to academic you, work. Thank you. Weather. Weather. Uh, Chijoke. Ada. I'm happy you people are following the footsteps of your brother. You're also doing well in your academics. Hmm? Thank you, Dad. Uh, I can't say the same about Joshua. Joshua. Joshua, Joshua. Josh? Yes, Mom? Are you here with us? Oh, yes, of course. <laughs> I'm what here. What do you have to say to your brother? Oh, yes, oh, wonderful. <laughs> congrats, congrats. It can only be hard work. You do well, <laughs> you gain well. Hey, Mom, in celebration, I want you to prepare my best meal today. <laughs> all right. <laughs> <laughs> so we can all eat in celebration. If that is sure. all you need. Sure. If that is all you need, you I can. will But that just give me the key to this. Definitely, is definitely. I can't fail you. Okay. I can't fail you. <laughs> <laughs> the best gift a parent can give to, to children is education. Oh, yeah. During our time. Hmm. If you get A's, maybe you got A's in all the things you, you know? They will kill native fowl for you. Bolo Bob. Yes, yes, I remember. For you. You're right, you're right. Hey, Bolo Bob. Hey, Bolo Bob. My God, take my glory. Look at the Bolo Bob. Hey, Bolo Bob. Josh, are you all right? Yes, I was um, actually happy that Okoko will be a king. No, no, mom. You give me a goat then. No, no, no. No, no, no. no. A, I'm, I'm, a, a giant, a giant pal. A giant pal. A giant chicken. For well, now, when well, you, well, you graduate, you can now go to. You know? Yeah, Mega, please bless me to hands so I can go to bed. Try. Five sixty-five. Just go. Only one game. I told you, if not because of your stubbornness. I said, no, let us play Juve in this game. My spirit told me, play Juve. But you said, no, that Barcelona. I told you, back I cannot be Juve. Look at it now. If not for your stubbornness, it would have been at least now. It would have been better. Huh? Been better. I am telling you. And I'm tired. There's nothing that I have not done to make money. Mosai came to make money. I'm here. If you go like this to look for money, go there for where? There's nothing that I've not tried that is not working. Where, how can I raise money? Who do you go to now to ask for money? My father now. Ooh. He does not have money. He does not have asset that he can sell. Connection, no way. How do you do it? I'm just tired. Because of you, I'm just suffering in this, in, the, in, this, in this village. One day I can understand you. I will tell me very well. Some fathers are so frustrating. Hmm. So my own father is a disaster. He's just a man with this thing, establishing children up and down. That is the only thing that he's good for, giving you advice that he has not practiced. Now, my sister's husband, that my hope is built on. Look at what happened. 
the last minute everything scattered. I heard it, brother. It's so terrible. We were already in church when we heard that the marriage was all over. That thing eh, affected me even more than my sister itself. Do you know that that man promised to take me to Canada to study, to do my master's? Wow, Canada! Would I be here? One day you would have been a big boy in Canada, man! Eh? Oh, that. You would have made it in Canada, eh? man! I'm telling oh, you! Oh, yeah, it's Trust me now! One year, two, by three years in Canada, eh? Mpuri ke bata here! Look, I would have made bastard money. I would have been hoping on you so much. Oh, my you brother. would have been my everything. Just look at it, look at it. Everything just scatter. Hi. Oh, no, no, no. My brother. That's a big chance eh? you lost. What, what, what would I be doing in this country like this? Frustrating country. Boy, you know something? I believe one day God will answer our prayer. I have this strong belief. Where is God though? Forget that. No before sky. Where God did now? No before up. Everywhere white. Every day God, 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 God. Don't worry, you go. But me. Ah, let's take it out. What's the first thing you're going to install in this laptop? Ah. I'll get it sorted. Not cut. What? <laughs> I know you like to download a lot of games. Of here, course. Right? You have to favor me, you know. I don't have the laptop. Oh, you can use it anytime. Yes, I can. Okay. So you're going to tell me the password when you put it. <laughs> wow, this is nice. Um, what's this button for? Yeah, this is a power button. Okay. Oh, look at this. Wow, it's so beautiful. Oh, thank, thank you. you. Congrats, thank brother. You. <laughs> Emeka, this is really nice. Yes, it's so nice. nice, right? I hope you don't download all the games in the world. Don't tell him your password, only me. Ha <laughs> ha, I'm not telling any of you my password. Mm. I know what you can do. I know what you can do. That's <laughs> about it. Oh, brother, this is so fine. Congrats. Thank you, baby. Ah. You know, that says I'll be a doctor. And I'm working towards that. Wow. Mm -hmm. That's a very nice profession. Congratulations. Mm. Thank you. I'm very proud of you. Mm. Come here. Mm. Doctor, <laughs> as for me, I'm going to be a lawyer. A lawyer? Yes. Because I see myself already in the Supreme Court. So that's it. <laughs> that's a very good one. Ah, I'm looking forward to it. What's this button for? Oh, this is the power button. Okay. This is a space key. Mm. Yes. Okay. You have a lot to teach me. I have a lot to teach you. But you will pay me for it. Um, Amy, when I pass my own jump, Dad will get my own present. Maybe a car. <laughs> mm -hmm. I, see. I know you love cars, right? Benz, Benz for that. Uh, speaking of present, I was thinking we could um, contribute some money to get our parents a present for their forthcoming wedding anniversary. What do you think? Mm -hmm. What do you guys think? That'd we nice. don't have money to do that. Uh, I know, but we can contribute the little we have, even if it's a token. Come on, they will appreciate it. They will be very, very proud of us. Let's, let's just do it. Yeah, I'm certain they will appreciate it. They'll be so happy. They will get them a present. And I have the perfect gift. Okay, I'm curious now. A strawberry vanilla cake. No. What? <laughs> what is wrong with her? Parents, because you love cake too much. She will finish it before it gets. Yes. Cake. Everyone loves cake. Ada, we're not getting cake. You want to eat that cake? I know you. Yeah, everyone has to eat the cake. Everyone loves cake. It's a cake. Uh, fine, fine. And I don't cake. think I like cake. 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 Uh, bro, just come and see. Uh, just welcome. Yes. What's going on here? Uh, we are admiring America's new laptop. Uh, we were talking about uh, getting a gift for our parents for their forthcoming wedding anniversary. That's a very good idea. What do you think? Wait a minute. Who called for this meeting? Um, it's not really a meeting. We're just... Um... Then what is it if it's not a meeting? Congregation of Vulture? How can you call for a meeting? as important as this to take such an important decision without me, the first son, presiding over it. Josh, you're getting it all wrong. This is not a meeting and we are not making any decisions here. Now listen, all of you, especially you, Emeka. I am the first son of this family and I will not let anybody whosoever with that position or trample on my rights in this family. 
Um, Joshua, this your comment is not necessary now. Now you will shut up and let me talk. Josh, why are you so hostile? Why are you embarrassing everybody? Can what is wrong I, with can you? Can I finish, please? Now I take exception to that. This is how trouble starts in families. When people that think they've achieved everything in life tend to disrespect their seniors. Now, by the power, vector power invested in me, as the legitimate and bona fide first son of this family, this meeting is considered over. Joshua. Yes. Primarily dismissed. Null and void. Let me warn. You see this insult just mated on me? The first son. Let it not repeat itself again. Especially those that think that they have achieved, that, that they just won a big scholarship. You're using me to learn English. You've not even gone to Harvard. You've not even gone to the UK. You're here speaking nonsense English. For me, you don't have respect. Okay? You don't have single respect. Because you won a scholarship, or is he a medal, or is he World Cup? People like Mark Zuckerberg, with all the money and achievements he has, he's humble. People like Bill Gates, with all his achievements, with all his money, he's humble and nice. Look at our own Dangote. With all the industries, factories, everything he has, he is humble and nice. But you, just because of ordinary scholarship that anybody has ever gotten, you are the first person that got it in life. You carry everybody in your head. You want to become the leader. You want to take over the, the position of the first son in this house. I will not allow you. So I'm talking to you, Emeka, most especially. No sense. It's not a decision. It's not a decision. Mm -hmm. um, Emeka, don't mind him. Hmm? Joshua, bona fide first son, legitimate first son, intimidating everybody. Carry your laptop, let's go inside my room. Mm -hmm. First son. We were happy before he came in, you know. Just cheer up. Honestly, I don't understand why Joshua is so hostile on me. He picks at me at every little thing. Mm -hmm. You should get used to it. Okay? What did you say this button was for? Again? I'm in the mood right now. Please just just let me think. Please just let me think. Brother Joshua. I don't like the way you're always harassing and embarrassing Brother Mecca every time. He, he's no good now. Eh? Are you envious of him? Are you mad? Are you alright? How dare you stand before me and talk nonsense? It's not nonsense, so. Don't you know all these things you are saying? He's giving you emotion now. Just shut up! If you talk, I'll slap all close out of your eyes. I don't know why you're being so unsat to everybody in this house. What is it, Seth? Eh? Every time you'll be shouting. Every time you're shouting. Ada? Starting when? Since when, Ada? Now listen. If I hear fame from you again, I will tell mommy about all the boys that you have been going out with on this street. So respect yourself. What are you even saying? Oh, you have forgotten. Have you forgotten that I, I, I still have the evidence with me? Okay, wait. So that in case you have forgotten, let me refresh your memory. Because I, 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 I can see you're, 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 you're going mad. Yes, this is it. Have you seen it? It is still fresh on my phone. This is the boy that always come to this house to look for you when our parents are out. And you think I don't know, I got a reliable information that anytime you're coming back from school, you branch to his house. That is it. It's a lie. There's nothing of this sort. Eh, hey, no problem. Don't forget, it is your word against mine. Eh? Try me in this house and you will see fire. I'll tell mommy that you're blackmailing because I caught you with a girl in the house. No problem, fine. When mommy comes back, I will tell her, I will know who mommy will believe if it is me or you. Don't also forget that Tony is ready any time, any day to come and testify against you. Hey, he's ready to come and say the truth that you are his girlfriend. <laughs> you're so mean. Yeah, you're so mean. 
My God. They are beginning to coach you now. Teaching you some bad things to disrespect your senior. You have forgotten that I am your elder brother in this house. If you give me the respect due for me, you will have peace. Failure to do that, I will give you the training that you deserve as the first son, bona fide and legitimate first son of this family. Hmm. In a, in a the dream. The dream is the only God that is everything that happens. <laughs> I can be envious of an auction. Everybody is now worshipping him now because he, he, he won one nonsense scholarship. <laughs> Uchi, see, hmm. see, see. There is something you really need to understand. Computer knowledge, your computer science knowledge, and your sound knowledge of IT. I mean, there is a way we have to make money. Let's use your brain and make money. My brother, what is it that we need to try? <laughs> yeah, what is it that we have not tried? <laughs> you remember Jonah in our class? Jonah now, Jonah is you. Jonah of course OBC. now, of course. Why Jonah not? is now a big boy. With Jonas? He drives cars, jeeps, just name it. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> Jonah has made it. Even the Roland you know. <laughs> Roland. Roland. Roland Onishi. The same Roland you know. Huh. He's now a multi billionaire How? How did they make money? You just need to understand. No, no. What do what are they doing? No, tell me what are they doing? Is it uh, uh, do, do they do ritual? No, no, no. Come on, don't say that. You know I can't involve myself in money ritual. I can't involve myself in that. See, there's this deal. It's a smart deal. Once we get involved in it, we make it real big. Trust me. My brother, what is it? Tell me, what is it? Okay. I have a friend. His name is Keska. He has the moves, the smartness, the idea that we need to be millionaires. Keska has the knowledge. Are you sure? I'm telling you. You are sure that <laughs> the process is legit enough? My brother, as long as it's legit, hmm? I will do everything that is legit to make money. 100% <laughs> legit. I can assure you. I can assure you. Just wait for me. Okay. Let me go and get something. I'm coming. All right. So the whole thing, it's for you to use your computer expertise to hack into the online transaction and divert the money. One time. Franco, this was not what we agreed. This is not legit. Come on, bro. It is. I mean, we are targeting on the politicians. They've been stealing our money. Yes, it is. This is our own way of sharing from the national cake. See, bro, it's legit. 100%. See, tell me, are you in or not? Okay. Good. I'm in. See, yeah, yeah, yeah. now I have the link. Okay. Your duty is to hack and load. Acon we provide the account details of the receiver. Do you understand why Franco here is the coordinator? Yes. You get. It's so simple. Coordinating things, as you know. Now, if the money drops on the account receiver's uh, account. Yes. And he runs away with the money car. Oh, come on. <laughs> come on. He dare not. The last person that tried to run away with our money is having a meeting with his ancestors <sighs> as I speak. Do you understand? Come on. Relax. I told you. 100% assurance. Come on, guys. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Don't need all that, bro. Relax. We are making it real big. I'm telling you. Trust me. <laughs>
of my father i don't even have access to his property i don't have access i don't know anything about his property but look at my younger brother my younger brother knows everything he has access to my father's property and it's it's annoying and you have mouth to be saying it are you not stupid uh, are you not stupid your own younger brother you the other one cook up. You don't even have, you don't even know anything about your father's property and you call yourself first son. Let me tell you. As the legitimate and bona fide first son of your family, you ought to know, up to the, your father's boxers, you have ought to know how he got it, where he got it and where he keeps it. Huh? If you don't know. Just do something on time now before it becomes too late. Before you know it, you become inconsequential in your family if you don't know. You see what Louis the say? This guy here no qualified to be our friend. When men stand, boy can stand. Imagine you day here, they panic. Say your younger brother won't do this, won't do that. These days, where borrow and paper they talk past human being, as you stand here now, just borrow and paper. You don't see yourself in prison. Oh. Now you day here, suffer they talk. Your daddy feel just sleep one night and dream bad dream. The next day carry phone call lawyer. May send everything to your younger brother. And when you're old, you do get man follow your younger brother. And Alright. Mm -hmm. Malai. <laughs> you no go. Yeah, you no go happen. <laughs> My brother, you have to put your brother where he belongs. Exactly. Earlier enough. I'm telling you. Because as a legitimate and bona fide first son, it is your duty to detect for him where he stands. What he does, what he is supposed to be doing, Mom, when you're there. For my family, who born monkey, who borrow a liver, when my own younger brother can't stand the shine eye for me, you know fit happen. See, as I day here, forget I get small body. As I day here, everybody they marry for that house. But once they hear sound of gay, they say, now me one step in. If every other animal relax, you understand? I will be your younger brother to oppress you. Guy, better do something. No, in fact, very soon. We go, we go come out and for this our first son union. Uh, yes, we we'll come out, you know, fit. The, the, the question now is, what will I do? What will I, because I am, 
I've, I've thought outside the box. Like, I've, I don't know what, I don't know. What, what will I do? Um, what to do, what to do, what to do? Oh, the only thing I, just yeah. make him, I get the idea. Yeah. Yes. Just wake up one morning, I kiss and say, in a homo. La bella homo, say sure. Yes. What happened to Homo Yes. He tell you, he go bam, where? That's the best way. Remember, say, that your brother, so they behave holy, holy, holy every Tuesday. They put Bible for ample, they pass. Mm. They never say with any gay. So your parents, neighbors, they will just believe you once. But, 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 but what if he denies it? He can he can deny it now. You be Jesus where they fear Peter's denier. What did they worry you? Uh, now what did that kiss person? You go just in the morning like this. If he mm. pass, you know, greet you. Call her Omo. What did they worry? You know, see me here. Oh, I know, greet big bros. If you see, I say, shake guy for road. If you snap, I say, go show your prayer and say, eh, they will believe you once. Just that bills are many half. That's it. Mm -hmm. Just make him uncomfortable. Uh -uh. Okay. Once you make him uncomfortable, he has no choice than to begin to respect your authority. The thinking time. alone, eh? You know, say, that name, Omo. The thinking will make him come to like who gave coronavirus. Uh, Allah. Not true, but people, go they, live. people that have coronavirus, they get, they oh, get yeah, HIV. Hey, HIV. Yes. Ah, Tony. Accuse them. They hit them like who they put fire for oven. The head go correct. Well, my own is not just about making me uncomfortable. I remember very well when we were growing up. One day, I, I came across, like, heard my parents having an argument, my mom and my dad. This one say, should I tell him? This one say, no, tell him. No, this one. Along the line, my father won the argument. And I begin to find, growing up, I was trying to, who were they arguing this thing about? It was a letter I found out it was a maker. Mm -hmm. I started investigating. I started looking out and let me see, what is this, this, should I tell him? Right no. And I found out that, I discovered that a maker is different from all of us. Hospital where he was born was different. The doctor that attended him and signed his birth certificate is different from the doctor that signed our own. He don't started having becoming intelligent more than all of us. Or every other person, look at my siblings, look at me. So he he was different from every other person. That's why I knew that he was not, and he was challenging me, the bona fide and legitimate first son. I put him where he's supposed to belong. Yeah, yeah, sure. But but your 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 brother he make her look small like your dad. Like he he he, he looks like your father. Like he's just a carbon copy of your dad. Sibuna, he can be a love child from another woman. Not a exactly. Home away. Exactly. Hey, man, why now? Home away. You see you this Tony, eh? You are sensible. <laughs> this is exactly what I was thinking. I'm sure this Emeka was a product of a broken condom somewhere. I said it. Don't look at it now. So now, product of useless being useless is coming to challenge bona fide and legitimate first son. Hi. You see that? It's the, it, 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 you see it? That is why I stood my ground. I made him understand that you are talking to the legitimate, the bona fide first son of Maloka family. You are here telling me that you're 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 angry or do this one or do the need for my she be don't see anything at the tell you don't hear your own side of the story now you see why they tell you because this guy if he continue to do more and more and more like woman so we'll go we we'll go leave you uh Marco eh? Marco don't be stupid it's an advice see just enter let me side. still give him the last advice because uh, you know even they pay for it uh, you know you are very smart the last advice what I feel give you now. You see that your brother. You know be Jesus who go the fear say Peter will deny you now. May he deny. They know that this person one day. If you just wake up in the morning, if you no greet, you say, hey, come on, why no greet me? Mm -hmm. If you just say and say, he shake another guy for real somehow, you say, ah. now don't start out. Simple. That these are the hit and like who they pull yeah. fire for food. Well, you can't go kind of one day. You know great choice that to come they do you. Ross. I'm not really gonna respect you. Ross. Ross. Even your father, that time he go believe say. God, no make mistake. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. You see, they are you wear earrings, they behave like you, like say you will you be you be too mad if you don't after, know. After dealing with after dealing with this my younger brother, uh -huh. after yeah. dealing with him. Yes now. Hey. Oh. Yes now. <laughs> just, just get out. Hey. Well, just go inside. Let's hey. see. I know the good oh, It's alright. Let her. It's alright. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Think I'll just do it now. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh -huh. That's what you did, eh? <laughs>
Um, she's okay. Joshua, are you happy with the way mom and dad are giving Emeka preferential treatment? Making all of us, every other person, look like slaves. Um, Joshua, you know Emeka is very intelligent and he has achieved so much within. Why do you talk like a fool sometimes? Yeah? All the time you were thinking like a child, thinking like a, I don't want to call you idiot. Eh? Okay. Don't you know that all these achievements that he's getting is as a result of the papa and the attention our parents are giving to him? Don't you know? Eh? Let me ask you. Did you not come first in your last term exams? Yes, I did. Did they celebrate it for you? No. Hey! Size, no, they didn't celebrate it all because they are giving him that professional treatment. Look at me, three years now, I've been writing jump. I will write, I will write, no success, no high score, nothing. But our parents dressed up from this house, went to jump office themselves, paid them huge amount of money. Meanwhile, I have been begging them. To help me get a mercenary. This thing I'm begging them is not even high. Yes, the amount of money it will take is 50,000. I will pass this and enter the university like every other person. They did not. Instead, they now went paid huge amount of money for them to give him high score in jump exam. And you are not thinking anything about this thing. And you, you don't see there's something wrong in this whole thing. Um, Joshua, um, are you serious about this? Oh, you don't even know what is happening. Like, you are in this house, you don't study what is happening. Wait, I will tell you more things that, that, is more, that, that have been happening in this house that are more interesting. Come. Ah, what do you mean are you serious? Hey! Hey! Oh! I told you! You are tired! Hey! hey. Don't just, just keep quiet! Don't say it! Keep quiet!
I told you this story to encourage you. The young man never gave up. In spite of difficulties and frustrations from the stepmother. <sighs> My daughter, you've been very strong. And I encourage you to remain strong and focused. I will, Dad. At least for your sake and mom's. I will. Thank you very much. The boy. Where is he? Hmm. I don't know. We lost contact after I relocated. But I'm very sure he's doing very well wherever he is. And I wish him well. On behalf of the boy, I must say thank you for helping him, Dad. It's so inspiring. Thank you, my daughter. You see, there is joy in giving and helping others. Giving is an aspect of love. And the more you give love, the more you get. And if you continue to give love, a time comes you become a magnet of love. I tell you this, the highest form of love is where you give without expecting reward. <laughs> That's what you always say. When you give without expecting reward. Exactly. Thank you, my daughter. Thank you, Dad. Back to my orange. Oh. <laughs> I'm sure you don't want to take mm, mm -mm. vitamin C. <laughs> oh. mm. Good for Corona. Man always following us. Are you owing him or something? I'm not owing him. This is not even the first time I'm seeing him. Anytime he sees me, he will be overacting and be saying nonsense. Hey, let's go. Give me money. I said, give me money. Give me money. Give me money. Give me money. I will tell you something. Sometimes these smart men can be saying the truth, but people might not understand. Saying we just need money to smoke. Let's go. We need to give him money. We tell him something. Let me give him money. So that he will leave us to you. Against brother. This is end of this story. This is the end of this news. This news is compiled by Clifford Madukalaya. Haramba, Haramba, Oje, you are my son, and if you are going in the wrong direction, it is my responsibility to take you back to the right track. The kind of company I see you keep in recent times is worrisome. Yeah. Yes. I mean, from the look in the faces of those young men, they look like criminals. And your company with them will not bring any good to you. Okay? Papa, those my friends, do you know them? How can you be calling innocent people criminals? Papa, they are not criminals, they are business guys. 
Business guys. So, what business do they do? Okay, Papa. They go on the internet, they buy and sell. That is the business they do because everything in this world now, whether you are in the village or in township, as long as you have internet, everything is transacted on the net. No. From what I see in those young men, they are not businessmen. Yes. They are criminals, internet fraudsters, scammers. And you don't need to get yourself involved in things like that. Believe me. Papa, that's the problem. That's why you are old school. These days, you don't need to walk, 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 walk. You can stay on your phone and make money. What they do, they buy and sell. Papa, those guys are businessmen using their God's given talent to take their own part of the national cake. They are all criminals. How can you call people that you don't know? You don't know how they operate just because they come here as my friends. You have labeled them criminals. Papa, no, that is not, it's not fair. It's not fair. I'm so sad that you have eyes but you cannot see. If you look at them properly, you will see criminality written all over them. Uchi, what you should be engaging yourself in now is looking for a very good job. A good job, yes. And work. Papa, I am not interested in going to people's offices to beg them for jobs that are not in existence. Looking for jobs that are not there. Me, go to somebody's office again to beg for a job. Papa, I do not have the connections. I do not have anybody to help me get a good job. Papa, I have decided now to sit down and hustle for myself. Go and look for a job, go and look for a job. Who, where, where is the job? Papa, that's your own time or our own time now is we make money through what we know, knowledge. Gucci. Eh? It took me enormous effort to build this image that we enjoy in this family right now. I don't want you to engage in anything that will tarnish the name and image of this family. Please. Okay? I've heard you, Dad. Thank you. Uche, life is a marathon and not a hundred meters dash. Yes, things are not rosy now. Things are rough for us now. But with time, they will ease off. Okay, just take it easy. I've heard you, Papa. Thank you very much. God bless you. God bless you, Papa. I've heard you. Thank you for your fatherly advice. Can I go now? Can I go? You're looking at me. You will not when I go now, you come back and say I walked out on you. Can I go? Thank you for your advice. Okay. You understood my advice, right? Thank you, sir. Thank you. When I think it's over, when I think I've lost all, that is when. When I think I'm a nobody, when I think my world has crumbled, that is when God oh. rests on me. Hey, my good will soon enter. There is no one in the talk rubbish here. Chess is 2 1. Wow. Mm -hmm. Today I must win money. This is what we are saying. Wait, 78 minutes. Wow. Uche. Ah, babe. Why are your face there like this now? Sit down. What I you don't want to sit down. Huh? Uche, I do not like the way you speak to dad. I don't like the way you make him feel bad. I mean, you blame him for everything that has gone wrong in your life. It's not fair. I mean, it's not even right. Babe, listen. Eh? A good name without money or assets 
It's nothing. A man has got to do what a man has got to do to feed his family. Exactly. Eh? A good name will always be better than money any day, any time. Do I blame you? You are a woman. One man now will just come for victim, carry you, and carry your problems to his house. But for me, I will stay in this house, be hustling, struggling, praying to God to bless me to build a house and marry. Can you see your tantrums? All I ask is, can you please stop making dad feel bad? It's not his fault that the economy is bad. Your father is the one harassing my life for trying to live my life the way I want to live it. He should leave me alone, no. He should leave me alone, no. Look, I don't want to end up as poor as he is. I'm on the fast lane. All my friends, they are doing well. Let your father leave me alone. I don't want to be as poor as he is. <laughs> oh, Maka! How could you have fallen so far? What, what is wrong with you? Have you forgotten all the sacrifices dad made to get us this far? How he sold his land? How he worked so hard to pay mom's bills when she had cancer, yet she died. He still put a roof over her head and food on the table. You blame him all the time. You insult him because he doesn't know any governor or any minister. Meanwhile, all he's asking of you is to stay away from the fast lane. Stay away from crime. How is that a bad thing? I mean, what? How could you be this ungrateful? Why are you so ungrateful? Sister, if you like, cry out blood. You see, blackmail does not affect me again. Leave me alone. If you not get money, hide your face. Full stop. What is it? I better come off for come off, come off for here. Don't come and give me your own bad luck. Oh. If this game no enter, me and you go put leg for one skirt. Oh. Uh -huh. Perfect. Perfect. Thunder go fire you. Thunder way get guy name go destroy you. Perfect. Okay, girl. Well, Emeka, we, your siblings, have decided to do the right thing today. To tell you the truth. You know, as they say, only the truth can set us free. I don't understand. What truth are you talking about? Emeka, <clears throat> There's a secret in this family. A big secret that we want to reveal to you here and now. A secret? What secret? Like you can see for yourself. Just look at us. From here, us. You can see that we are different and you are different from us. And that is why you do everything you do differently. That's why our parents treat you differently too. What's all this difference, difference, difference? Look, I have an assignment to do now. I have to go. Oh. You want to work out on us? This actually shows you don't have respect for your elder brother. You've forgotten I'm your elder brother. But let me remind you that I am the bona fide and legitimate first son of this family. And I demand the respect, especially from you. Well, the difference I was talking about before your rude intervention of almost walking out on us is that you, a maker, you are not a member of this family. Yes! You were an abandoned child somewhere picked up by our mother into this family. And that is why you are treated differently. That is why you are different in everything. And you are treated differently. You are pampered by our parents so that you will not feel isolated. What exactly are you talking about? What kind of silly joke is this? What's wrong with you? Do you even know what you're saying? Am I the one you're shouting? You're, you're, you're standing off. <sighs> eh? Don't you have respect? 
You know it. You don't have common respect for your seniors. First them. You're standing up. Oh, you want to beat me? Let me tell you if you don't. Hey, hey, hey. Joking. I'm very angry. Respect yourself. Let me tell you something if you don't know. Let me give you a complete lowdown of this family so that you will know where you belong. Because you don't belong to this family. Like I told you. After my mother gave birth to me, making me the bona fide and legitimate first son of this family, it took her a very long time before she conceived. When she finally did, she gave birth not to you, but to Chijuki here, making him bona fide, legitimate second son. Then, Ada followed. As for you, you were abandoned in one place, one dungeon. My mother saw you, beat you, fixed you in between. When she was finding it difficult to conceive. Now, hey, 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 hey. Don't say, if you say a word, okay, you can go over here. Shut up! If you want to call me, call me, put Uncle Josh. I am not your mate, I am not your brother. Like I was saying before, you rudely interrupt the bona fide and legitimate first son. You were in one dungeon somewhere. My mother picked you up, brushed you, fixed you in between. All these things I mentioned, did you see yourself in this lineage? Did you? You better go and look for where you came from. Find your square root. I am the bona fide, legitimate first son. Chidoka here, bona fide, legitimate second son. Then Ada, go and find your square root. No, they will. professional treatment and they are making us look like fools, like idiots, like slaves in our own father's house. Is it fair? Eh? He has been the one taking all the blessings that you were supposed to take as a second son. Eh? No, are, are, you, are you happy about it? No, you can't be happy. Even if you're happy, it is my duty as your senior brother to reset your brain so that you will see the ills of this whole thing, what is going on in this family. It's not good. Eh? But don't worry, hmm? I have it all planned out. I have strategized a means to make this thing so that you will take your full position as a second son in this family. Now listen. When I inherit everything from mommy and daddy, hmm? I am going to share it into two equal parts. I, nobody will cheat anybody. I will give you one part. Then you will assume your post, your position as a second son. Hmm? So don't worry. Um, I'm Joshua. So what of Ada? Won't she partake in the sharing? Who is Ada? Our sister Ada. We are talking about men. We are talking about Ada, who is a girl. Ada doesn't know anything. Ada is just a small girl. Eh? She doesn't even know anything. Eh, maybe by that time, even though I know that very soon I will inherit the property, but maybe by that time, Thank God she's growing. She would have gotten married to another man, being another man's family. 
and be answering another man's name. Will she come from her husband's house and be asking for property here? Is it possible? Eh -eh. That is why I said that this family belongs to you and I. Men in the family. First son, second son, not a maker, a stranger. So all I need now is your support. Let us fight this household enemy. Let us fight this war and win it well, legitimately, as the children, bona fide children of this family. Who is where you are talking about? Look at you. Eh? A whole legitimate son. Look at the way you're dressing. Look at the way you look. Look at your maker wearing all the designers. And you see, you see, there's nothing wrong. That open your eyes to reality, oh. Open your eyes and know you better follow me as a first son, bonafide first son of this family to fight this battle and win it. If not, if not, everything that belongs to you will go to a total stranger. And I know what you know that what that means. How was it? Rebera? Yes. It was great. It was great. Uh, after that, we had a, a woman a meeting. You know, so that's why it lasted for three days. Mom, I hope you're not stressed. <laughs> yeah. uh, Mommy, I even hurt my feet while playing football. Uh, <laughs> oh, really? Congratulations. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. <laughs> Have you told the maker that I sent for him? Yes, Mommy, he's coming. Sorry. Right. I'm going to help you. Please, don't even start. You share it. Is that how you go out and stay in one wild way? Why are you like this? Are you alright? You, you, you are crying. Uh, what is going on here? Uh, Emeka, what's the problem? What is wrong with him? Dad. Yes? Mom. Yes, dear. Who are my parents? I, I, I beg your say? pardon? What, what did he say? I asked for my parents. I just tell, just tell me. What kind of question is that? that? Please, just, just tell me the truth. I will kill myself, please. No, 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 no. What have they done to my? Do not touch me, mom. Do not touch me. I need answers right now. Hmm. Emeka, Chukwe Emeka. If you are still my son, and you are still normal in your head. Calm down and explain this thing to us. What are you talking about? You are embarrassing us. What is the matter? Dad, while you were away, my siblings gathered and told me I'm a stranger in their midst. They said I was an abandoned baby when mom picked me up and that's why I'm very different. Do I look different? Do I look different? What? What? Somebody said that? She's okay. Daddy. Is, is, is it true what he's saying? That it's Joshua. Jo Joshua. Joshua! 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 Joshua, what is the meaning of all this? What kind of joke is this? A joke? Didn't you tell America your sibling? That he was an abandoned child? That, 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 that he's, he's just adopted into his family? Didn't you say that? 
whatever that means, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. But what's funny? That you just said is a joke. What's I was only joking with him. What kind of sick joke is that? What kind of depraved joke is that? Joshua, are you mad? But that we all know in this house how we normally joke with ourselves. Like he practically jokes with me and said that I'm a blockhead and I'm a troublemaker. And I, I just gave him a jab. I I joke back at him. That's that's all. What kind of expensive and stupid joke is that? Do you know the amount of emotional trauma you've made him pass through these few days? Just so, look at your brother. Look at how lean my son has become. Joshua, why are you so weak and treacherous? Why? Why? Hey, Daddy, it hasn't gotten to that. It was just a joke, normal joke that we joke among ourselves. That's all. Uh, Dad, I'm, I'm sorry. I, I, I didn't mean to upset anyone. Sorry for your sick self. Sorry for yourself. Joshua. Joshua. You see this table you are shaking? It's too large. Bigger than you. How could you? Do not push it. How could you? Do not. Because you won't stand your faith. You will not stand your feet. I'm saying myself. I have just said my own. Do not push it. What nonsense? Don't! What, 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 what kind of joke is this? No, please, I'm sorry. Your own brother? You just manufacture this nonsense? No, I'm sorry. It will repeat itself again. Please. Get out. Get out of my presence! Why is this so mean? Come. Come, my son. Wipe your tears, okay? Hmm? I'm okay, sit down, sit down, come on, sit down, sit down, sit down, sit down. You, 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 you just heard him, okay? It, it's a joke, a, a silly joke for that matter anyway. But it's, it's nothing, okay? Calm down, it's nothing. Don't, Don't mind you. your brother. He's just being mischievous. Sir, America, you heard him. He was just joking. Though it's such a stupid joke, but it's still a joke, so please calm down. Okay, don't take it to heart, eh? Okay? How could you ever believe that we are not your parents? He made me believe every word he said. And even uh, Chidioke and Nada couldn't even support me. They supported him. Serious? They even walked out on me. Chidioke. Daddy. Ada, you both think you're still children? You think you're still babies? Daddy will try to... You tried to work? Come get out. Get out of here, both of you. Nonsense. Can you destroy it? Daddy, I'm sorry. Son, look at me. Look at me. Don't feel you look alike. Huh? You're like my photocopy. How could anybody convince you that you're not my son? Come on, look at your mom. Look at your mother. It's okay. It's okay, my dear. I'll take care mm? of this matter. I will. Huh? Me. Now go fresh enough. You have a lot to share with your siblings. Come on. Give me that smile. <laughs> Mommy, come and give you the best. Eh? I'm, I'm very hungry. I haven't even eaten in days. Oh my mm, God. Hmm? See, I am coming to make your favorite. Okay? I don't yeah. mind being tired. I'm going to make a special meal for you. Okay, Mom. Yeah. Come in. Fresh enough. Yeah, my boy. Smart. Calm down. Calm. 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 We are we are great on this. We are great on this matter. No, 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 please. Not now. Not, not now. Bob! 
told you. I told you, sister, this is for you. Huh? Papa, some people said I will not make it in this life. Papa, I have come. I have come to take away shame from you. I have come so that you will stop lamenting your son, Ebugozu. Sister, see, hmm? no idiot, no idiot born of a man we come to you again to play you while you that he wants to marry you and hurt your feelings because your brother is now a rich man, a millionaire. I have made it big time, big time. Listen, you will stop that teaching job because you cannot have a brother like me and you are doing million jobs that you are, you are teaching. For what? Sister, nobody will insult this family again. Ebugomozu, this money is too much. The money is, is, is destroying my movement. Eh? I just came to announce to you people. Eh? I want to see my friends now. Kambiakwa no. The papa lo lo. Kambiakwa. The papa me. Kambiakwa. The ego is too much. All the too much. <laughs> eh? <laughs> when I think I'm a nobody, when I think my world has crumbled, that is when God restored me. Oh. Never you lose hope. God is the hope to the hopeless. Never. You Life is good. Uchi. Mm. How did you come about this huge sum of money, you know, suddenly, that you are splashing like this? Dad. What kind of question is that? No, no, no. I don't understand you. You are asking me how I made my money? The billionaires, the millionaires, and our TV politicians that have stolen our national treasure. If you see them, will you ask them how they made money? Oh, oh, because I am your son. You never believed that I was going to make money and now I have made money? Anyway, I will tell you. Dad, I know your mind now will be telling you that uh, maybe I stole money or I did a uh, money ritual. No, I can't do that. You brought me up where? I am into online business. I am practicing what I read in school, computer engineering. I am a computer engineer. Dad, you paid my school fees, isn't it? Or, oh, sis, is it wrong or am I wrong to practice what I learned in school? Do you understand what I'm saying? Dad, calm down. Sister, little sis, eh? your brother has made money. I am a millionaire. No idiot called a man, born of a woman, will come to you again to break your heart. Is he mad? Your brother has money, so you have money. My money is your money. So you will calm down now, look for who loves you and the person that you love before you marry because you have money now. Come for for cheap. Idiots. Let us say this. Please advise daddy properly that we are now, we are, you know, enjoying this jet age, digital age. Anyway, let me tell you something. You guys should write what you want now. List it. Shoes, bags, jewelries, anything that you want. If in one minute it's not provided, then you know that I am not the son of my father. 
Daddy is my daddy. Now, let me tell you something. I know. In your mind now, you think it's only a man that will go to the bush to cut trees, dig a hole and cover it. He's working hard. No. No. Dad, this is our time. This is our time. Digital age. The jet age. We go online to take what belongs to us. <laughs> Daddy, he go out there go. The money is too much. Daddy is my daddy. <laughs> uh, yes, Dad. When did you start drinking alcohol? Ah, ah. alcohol. Me, drink alcohol. Are they Chris? I don't get sense. I cannot drink alcohol. Oh, you, oh no, this is red wine. Dad, you have always told me that red wine is good for your heart. <laughs> when you drink it like this, you just sweat. You see, I'm sweating like this. As you're drinking red wine, it will just palpitate your, you know, it's pushing. Sweat is just becoming, you know, sweat is sweet. <laughs> Dad, even in the Bible, red wine is written there. Drink it. <laughs> Little says, advise daddy properly. Tell him that this is the young age of digital performance. Uh, well, um, I have an urgent meeting now. We have an urgent meeting of the young millionaires. We are going to be deliberating on how we are going to transform ourselves from being millionaires to billionaires. Come, Japan. <laughs> daddy. Daddy is my daddy. <laughs> Hey, ha! Dad. Uh, mm. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> my daddy. Come, Jacquano. Come, Jan. He says red wine is not alcohol. This is not the Uche I brought up. <laughs> red wine is not alcohol, Dad. He says Uche. When I think I'm a nobody, when I think my world has crumbled. So it's come now. Let's go to my friend's book now. What about the money you promised me? Money. Don't worry, I'll give you. Hmm? When? Hmm? You keep on promising me. I need that money. I need that money this Saturday for my cousin's wedding. Um, this Saturday. This Saturday. Uh, how much? How much are we talking about? I told you thirty k. Thirty k. Yes. I need to make my nails, do my lashes, and you know all these things cost money. Um, okay, just um, give me some time. You know how difficult it is getting money from your parents, especially when they're old school. So I need to go home and restrict the guy, look for a way to collect this money from him. Alright? But you are the first son. Eh? Everything he owns belongs to you. His cars, money, everything. You're the one not playing your games well. Do you know what? My own elder brother chased all of us out of the house when our father died. And nobody could do anything about it and you're here telling me. You, you know, you're very correct too. As the bona fide and legitimate first son of our family, I own everything. Having told me this, once I get back home now, I will make sure I collect that money from my father. If he wants war, I'll give him war. If he wants peace, I'll give him peace. That is what I will do. Better. Mm? So just calm down, alright? You know I don't like it when you... Oh, you don't talk. Come mm. Where are you coming from? Where are you going to? Hey. Oh, I'm going back home. I went to buy something for mom. You want to buy something for mom? And you didn't see any other road to pass? It's only this place. Why are you monitoring me? What is it? What, what, why, why can't you stay in one place? 
Yeah? Please, please, I don't want your troubles. Eh? As you can see, I'm going back home. Did I disturb you? You don't want my troubles. If, if, if I stop, come on, start going home. If you like, go back home now and talk rubbish. Eh? I've told you, I will swallow you. You champagne and you can piss you out in the toilet. You, this, this, this swarm. Ah, come, 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 start going home. I said, I'm, I'm a man. No. Don't mind her. This is how she behaves. Following me everywhere, like monitoring spirits. Eh? Evil, evil, evil spirits. Maybe let's go. Calm down now. I, I told her I will give you this thing now. I Calm down this. now. I, I will give you. Uh, it's not Saturday. Before Saturday, you get it. There's still time. Why? The more you get angry, the more you, you look fine. Yeah? You get it, baby. Come on. Say me, man. Let's go, baby. Yes. <laughs> I need some money. Money for what? I, I, I want to use it for my jam. Jam? Yes, Dad. How much? Uh, it's um, 30,000. 30,000 Naira. 30,000 Naira? Yes, Dad. For jam, eh? Jam form, eh? Yes, Dad. But you told me last week that jam was 20,000 naira and I gave you the money. Yes, that I, I told you it was 20,000 because that's a part payment. I had to do that, do it that way so that when I, could, when I want to complete the remaining one, it will not be big, it will not be like a person for us. That's why I had to pay the first installment so that they will actually keep hold it down for me. And when I pay the installment, I will be eligible to write the exam. That's it. Mm. That's very thoughtful of you. Yes, sir. Mm. Very intelligent of you. Thank you, sir. Wonderful. So that means um, the total for the jump exam is 50,000 Naira. Yes, sir. Mm. Wow. Wonderful. You think you are talking to an illiterate father, eh? You think you are talking to, to, to an ignorant man? Joshua, I'm asking you. I, I don't understand. So you you, you you forgot that I am an engineer, a qualified and a practicing engineer. I passed through this system too. So when when has jump from moved from five thousand, ten thousand naira to, to fifty thousand naira? Things are very expensive. Now. Really? Yes. Wonderful. Okay, you know, ordinary pure water, but everything I've added money, double of pure water that is two times the price. Really? Don't you know how much dollar is now? Yeah. Dollar is affecting everything in this country. So. Not to, not to talk of something as, ex, as as very delicate and very sensitive as jam. They know people will buy now. Mm. And the people, if they know these people's, they, it's their people's future. Mm. So they actually know that if they add money, people will actually buy. Mm. So that's why they are doing it. People well, are well. buying it. That, 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 why would my own be different? So you are this smart and you cannot pass even one exam. You are still talking all this nonsense. You forget that I, I could I could just confirm it from, from here. Yes, from now, Google. Check it. It's just that they won't put it online because most of them are subletting. They buy and resell. That's what they do. Oh, really? yeah. So that's why it's 50,000 naira. That and it is yeah. the selling ones that you want to buy. You don't want to buy from source. Listen to me. Listen to me, son. And listen good. I don't have problem giving you money. I have the money to give. That's why I give to Emeka, I give to Chijo, I give to Ada, I give to my wife, and I give to you too. I don't have problem giving you any amount of money for this jam form, but the question is, how can you pass this exam when you do not read? Why would you say that? I so, have never seen you study your books, never. So all the while that I read in this house, it does, okay fine, I read in school. When I come back sometimes, I will have to rest, because the hassles and the sun and everything will be very much on me. So sometimes I will have to join the day, you see me playing, talk to you, behave anyhow, you think I don't read. Sometimes I will just enter the house, cover myself with duvet, carry torch, put the book on top of the wheel, use the torch and be reading it. Or sometimes when I get tired, I go to the parlor on the TV. People will think I'm, I'm in, in the parlor watching TV. Then I will just go back inside. Sometimes I even go inside the toilet, open the book, I will be reading it. 
So I read, I read fast, I read very well because I want to come out in flying colors this time. So I read. Wonderful. Joshua the reading, reading, reader. Eh? So you read under the two bed, you read in the toilet, kitchen, everywhere. So what is the result of all the reading? How come you have not passed even one jump exam? Oh yeah, tell me. Oh. Answer me now. You read on that way, you read everywhere, you read on the road like a madman. Yet you cannot pass even one exam for three good years. Three consecutive years you've been taking jump exam. You've not passed one. Last year you scored 80. The brother scored 258. 285. Joshua, are you not ashamed of yourself? You stand here lying to me and talking nonsense. Are you not ashamed of yourself? Hmm. All this interrogation is just for another 30,000. Eh? All this into all this whole all this whole all question. Oh, so if it is if it is a maker now, you will give him the whole world. You won't even ask him one question. You just keep your hand into the pocket and even give him more. Yes, because he is doing well in his academics. He is doing well. He has never failed any exam. It's, not my, it's not my fault. Oh eh? you pamper him, you support him in everything. You've never supported me. Really? Wonderful. But I remember that Chijo came first in his last exam. Chijo came. So who am I pampering and who am I not pampering? But that, why is it that all the time you compare me and this Emeka? This useless Emeka? Eh? Okay, Wait, no, do you think that even this Emeka will stand where I stand? Eh? Where, 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 is, where, where, where? You forget that I'm, I'm your bona fide and legitimate son in this house. And so? Mm. First son in this family is supposed to, I'm even supposed to be the one to inherit everything. You're even up to your boxers. I'm the one to inherit it. Really? Eh? You're comparing with the maker who is even the second son. I don't even have an inheritance in this, in this whole thing. Therefore, oh, you know about inheritance, eh? You're going to inherit everything that I have. Wonderful. Oh, really? Now I can see how intelligent you are. How very bright you are. You forgot there's something called a wheel. Hmm. Joshua, you forgot there is something called a will. I'll leave it at that. I'll leave my presence. I'm not giving you any money. I am not giving you any money. You are lying. Get out of here. What, what, what's, what's all this now? What's, what's all this? Get out of my presence. I'm not giving you any money. You are an irresponsible son. First son. Inherit. You can as well come and kill me. So you can inherit everything quickly. Come and kill me now. Why, why are you crying? What was it? Tell me. Your dad has refused to give me money for my job. Eh? I went to meet him today. Instead of him to give me the money, he's telling me to my friend that my friend will have used less to him that the maker is far better than me. Eh? Why would he always do that? Always comparing me with the maker. Why? Eh? When will he start? Will he understand the fact that our stars are not the same? They are never the same. I can never be the same. Even if they are the same, I will change it. Yeah? When will we, we, we understand this? Why can't you just understand it and just leave me alone? Leave me alone! Stop crying. Stop crying. It's okay. See? It's okay. Yes, Tom. I'll tell your dad to give you the money. But please, try and live up to expectation. Your younger one should be looking up to you and not the other way around. Thank you, Mommy. Thank you. Your mom, please, I need this money latest tomorrow. If not, they will chase me out of the class. I won't be able to write. I won't be able to write this exam. Then he will now see so many other things to talk about that I'm used there that I'm not. Right? Is it my fault that that I I scored low in in jam? It's okay. Eh? It's okay. This thing is the things that the small mistakes I make. Eh? Sometimes misses tricks and all that. Enough. If he doesn't give you the money, I will give you the money. I will give you my own money. Eh? Yes. <laughs> You will give me your money. Yes. You see? You see why I say you are the best mom in the whole world? You see it? You see? 
I, I wish that used to encourage me this way. Eh? This is the reason why I decided to drop being a pilot and I decided to be a medical doctor. So that we bring out the name of this family to the limelight. But instead of him to encourage me, from this course I want to read, it has a lot of chemical formulas. If they lift my head now, there's no way I can concentrate and write these exams well. Now, after they will say I'm not scoring high in jam, just like a mechanic. Meanwhile, they encourage the mechanic and support him. Me, nobody encourages me. How would I write well and come out to the colors? Enough. Yes, mommy. Can you promise me something? Just do something for me. What, what is it? Action. Josh. Yes, Lord. Stop tormenting your younger brother, Emeka. He loves you. Can you do that for me? There is not that that is always comparing two of us. Why would you be comparing the two of us? Eh? Emeka is not doing it. He's not the one comparing. Love him. He loves you. Please. Can you come and speak? I'll try. Just try. You need to love him. Mom, you, you, you said you give me the money if Daddy doesn't give me. Don't try to change the topic. I'll give you the money, but please love your brother. I just came back. I need to rest. Excuse me. <laughs> something I want to tell you. It's been eating me up for a very long time. Eating you up? Come. Come and sit, my dear. Sit. What could that hey, be? Adam! Hey, Mom, can you believe that Ada left all the plates that she's supposed to watch unwashed in the kitchen? And I told her I'm hungry and I want to eat. Now there is no plates for me to use to, to, use to, to, to eat. Eh? Ada, you are becoming stubborn. Josh. You are becoming stubborn. Now stand up and go and wash that, even if it's two plates, so that we eat. You know I eat well. Josh! Yes, mommy. Maybe you're mistaken. I met her washing the dishes. She left it! You see this girl? I've, I've been telling you that Ada is becoming very... I don't know who is engineering her. She's becoming very stubborn. Immediately you left, she left the plates. Ada, go and wash these plates now. Um, my dear, you said you wanted to tell me something. Finish washing? Yes. Stand up now and go and wash the plates. Stop, 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 stop talking. I am talking. Just keep quiet. Yes, mommy. Go and finish what you're doing, then you come. Hmm? Mom is here to listen. Ada, go and wash these plates now. Okay. Go, go, go and wash it. Mommy, I'm, I'm sorry for. I'm shouting. Let me. I'll, I'll come. There's something I will tell you. I wash plates. Ah, uh, Josh. Leave me alone! 
Me? Devil? Okay. I will show you what a devil really does and how they behave. By the time I go in there and tell mommy everything that has happened, we will now know who is the devil between you and... I've done nothing wrong. You are the bad egg in this family. You that is the good egg, who laid you? Who laid you that is the good egg? Let me warn you. I've been tolerating your nonsense. The way you challenge me in this house is coming too much. Mm. The day I will eat you, I will chew you like granite. Swallow you with champagne and go and piss you out. Cray cray. Respect yourself, oh. Respect yourself in this house. Don't forget, I am the bona fide and legitimate first son. Your own is Jara. You came into this house as Jara and respect yourself. Go inside. All about life is so deep. All about life is so wide. All about life is so mysterious, be careful. All about life is so deep, all about life is so wide. All about life is so mysterious, be careful. Greediness is so deadly. You might think you've made it through, never offend. Mama, just enjoy yourself. Mama, I'm telling you. Hey, is that the one inside this place? The money is here, the money is here, the money is here. Baby! Whoa! Come on, bigger than my Enjoy yourself, enjoy yourselves. My mama, smile, smile. Eh? This money is real. Mama, smile. I told you. Eh? I said it. All about life is so deep, all about life is so wide, all about life is so mysterious, be careful. All about life is so deep, all about life is so wide, all about life is so mysterious, be careful. Greediness is so deadly. You might think you've made it through, never offend the innocent. Because God knows the best way to fight back. Oh. Yes, Dad. I know you have tried to explain to me the source of your money. But I, I can't deceive you. I can't pretend to understand the suddenness of the money. But that aside, uh, my major worry, my concern right now, is your ostentatious lifestyle. You are living a very loud life. I mean, you no longer spend time in this house. 
You practically live in hotels. And of course, that is expensive, you must agree. The money you spend in hotels, you will agree with me, can renovate this house. And better still, you can buy a plot of land anywhere you like and build a house for yourself. Look, I'm your father. There are a lot of advantages in acquiring landed properties. Trust me. Because when the going gets tough, they can become very handy. So I really do not agree with you. Papa, to God who made me, Uche Chukwe Emego, Ebutego Mi Ike. But, you just lie. I like it's good assay. That assay will. I am not wasting money in hotels. You don't just stay and conclude. My business, it's all about going to hotels because that is where the money comes from. We have foreigners that come in. They will be lodged in hotels and I will not leave them there. I must be there to monitor them. Now, they will not come here. I have friends. They smoke. I'm sure if I bring them here for them to be smoking, you won't like it. That's why we are all in hotels. Yeah, you might think they have a reckless life and all that, but Father, I tell you what. Eh? That their reckless life is where the money comes in. Oh, yes. So, confirm before you conclude. Well, it's okay. But my people have a saying that it is the responsibility of the elder to advise. While it is that of the young one to listen, and obey. Papa, have I not sat down to listen to you? Am I not listening to you? I sat down, saint, preventing me from going for my business. Have I not been listening to you? Well, you have. So where have I gone wrong? Anyway, as a father, I will tell you thank you for your concern. But I'm telling you that I know what I'm doing. That I've gone through hell. I don't want to return to where I was coming from. Father, I'm rich. Yeah, what you advise about that. But all those are in line. And this is not the kind of um, house that I want to build for myself. I want to change your situation. Huh? When I want to begin my own house, you will know. You will know my style. Not your old school time, no. When I begin, I'll go to the market, buy everything, put them. Then the house will begin. Do parkour before you open your eyes and close it again. Do poko there. I can Do you understand me? Can I go now? Thank you very much. Father, <laughs> how can you be telling someone what you don't know? You have not done it before and you are telling me how I, am, I should do my business. 
The kind of one I've touched, have you touched it? If I don't sit down now to listen to you, they'll say, I'm very arrogant. I'm stubborn because I have money. What kind of rubbish is that? You are saying what you don't know. Ah. You're advising me. Can you give what you don't have? Try to understand. I need this money urgent to sort out some things. Once the new deal clears, I'll sort you out. Five million naira. Where will I get it from? I don't have that kind of money, please. Now, when the money, you see, you forgot so soon that I introduced you to this business, and now you got your first pay. You're trying to mess me up. I mean, come on. Try to understand, man. Franco, the way you're taking this thing is not the way it is. This money, I know day. Eh? Hey, God, I've been spending money attending to issues. Everybody in this family now is on my head. Guys, you understand? $50 million naira, he will on this business. You collected 50 million. Now, calm down now. What is 50 million? So, are you saying you won't give me this money? Is that what you are talking about? Listen, again, you may go. I will finish now. You collected 50 million for crying out loud. What are you saying? Frank, what you say? Now, trouble. Just they have been asking for money as I don't have. What do you think they shall have 50 million? Right. Yeah, 50 million or not? Yeah. Okay, raise me 4 million. Let me sort out. I don't need 3 million. I need 4 million. I need to sort out things. I calculate everything. Try to understand. Now, Franco, now 3.5 I go give you. I beg. I go transfer them to you before the end of the day. Okay, send it right. Send it now. Send it right now. now Franco, I don't understand you. But now, get it. It's an emergency. Uh, give me the number, please. 001 Okay. Yes. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
I think this one is still okay, right? Yes, mom, it's still fine. Mm -hmm. I had take. When I'm done with secondary school, you dash me most of your weeks. No, season. I'll buy new ones for you. Ooh. Mm. It's nice. When you don't come, Bin, you go to the salon down the street, give them to wash for me and uh, roll it. Okay? Okay, mom. Um, um, mommy. Mm? Remember when um, I wanted to tell you something the other day before Brother Joshua walked in and asked me to go wash the plates? Mm-hmm. I let her ask and you said it's nothing. Well, there is something. There is something? Mm-hmm. It's as if you sound serious. It's very serious. You and Dad need to caution Brother Joshua in this house. What did he do? Do you know that Joshua brings girls into this house when you and Dad go out? Ada! Joshua brings... Hey! Yes, so All the money you have been giving him for jam, he gives them to some useless girls out there. Yes. Eh? Yes, do you know that I caught him red-handed in the sitting room? Making out with one girl. Yes. In my own sitting room. And he tried to beat me. If I ever tell you what that. And he's very envious of Bonemeka. He always looks for every reason to paint him black. And he tells me and Chijoki to, to help him ag ag to be against Bonemeka. Ada. Hmm? Ada. Ma. Are you serious about this? I'm very serious. Do you know that he, 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 he formed all sorts of lies against me? And he said that if I ever tell your dad about his bad behavior, he will tell you that I have a boyfriend. Mm -hmm. Yes, now. Oh, this is too much. I can't take this anymore. Joshua! 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 I just cannot believe this. Joshua. So this is the nonsense you've been doing behind our back. Eh? Your mates are out there doing great things. But what do you do? You're only thinking about how to be useless. How could you bring a girl into my house? That is the last 30,000 you gave him. He gave it to one wayward girl living in the next street. A girl that even small secret. Secret? In public. Joshua. So, and you told me you needed the money to register for... Jam! Jam lesson. No, he doesn't go for any jam lesson. I went to his jam lesson center yesterday to look for him. And they said that he has not come for class for over one week now. What? What is wrong with you, Joshua? What is the problem? That, that, it, it's a lie, you. It's a big lie. You see this other you're seeing? This thing she's just saying to cover up all the bad things she has been doing when, you, when you, you, are, you are out. This girl at her age, as small as she is, she has the infantry to be going out on the streets, hugging boys and kissing boys on the streets. This, this girl, Ada, 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 you know you don't have any evidence. You know that. And you know I have all the evidence and I have a witness that will come and testify that you're his girlfriend. What, 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 what stupid evidence are you talking I about? I want to see the evidence. What evidence? Oh, let me show you. So that you will know who is lying between myself uh, and her. Show them! Yes. You know that this girl, you just spoke her up. Let us see the evidence. Let us see the evidence. Evidence. Stop talking. Lawyer, the evidence. Let me show you now. Spoiled, spoiled brat. Can't be calling somebody spoiled brat. You pass any post, you are calling somebody spoiled brat. You dare bring a girl inside my house? I want to see the evidence. I'm, 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 I'm looking for it. You are looking for the evidence. Eh? Spoiled child. Evil child. What happened to what? What were you expecting to see? I know you don't have any evidence. I had it in my I knew you were a bad person. But I never imagined you could be this, 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 you could be such a nuisance. Terrible nuisance. He's just bluffing. This is how you disgrace our family name in public. No, try it. If you dare. Punch my daughter. If you dare. Punch my daughter. Let me 
chop you raw. Evidence. Ipa, 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 Sumura government in school. When I actually provide the evidence. Eh? You want to provide evidence? Which evidence? My friend, kneel down there. Come on, kneel down. What is wrong with you? I want to get in there to do that. I'm passing with ordinary comments. Not to talk about that. Rex! 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 I've been pushed. I have been pushed. I have been pushed so hard. Okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay. I'll deal with him. I'll place him where he belongs. Probably I'm sorry. Dad, I'm sorry. Jesus. I'm not a bad child. I'm your legitimate and bona fide first son, a good boy. Don't go and die because you're a legitimate and bona fide son. And you get back to yourself, eh? You get back to yourself every time, legitimate and bona fide son. It's just the devil's work. I'm not always like this. Which devil are you talking about? You are the devil. He is the devil. Joshua, so you are the devil. I don't know when I do them. Please, Daddy, mommy, please. Daddy, please forgive him. He's sweating already. After all, the prodigal son left the house and squandered the father's wealth and came back and asked for forgiveness and father forgave him. But I don't want to be like the prodigal son. You are already a prodigal son. Oh my God. I am sorry to tell you this. No, no, I'm not. Because it's... trusting you it will be a problem no, for it's, me. No, it's the devil, it's the devil, it's the devil's work. I, I, I don't believe God like will this. bear us witness that we have given you all the care, affection any parents can afford. Yes, if you are but what parents. did you do? You chose to be different. All you do is to cause us sadness and anxiety instead of happiness. Look at you. Just look at yourself. You are bleeding. I don't want to be a prodigal son. Repent us. You are one of it. I pray for you. I pray that you don't push me to the wall. I pray that this repentance you are talking about and your apology will remain permanent. No, it's, 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 it's real, mommy. It's, it's real. Please, I want to be taken, I promise. Ah, please. Hey! Please. Hey! Please, 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 Always know. Please, please, Always suspected that something like this will happen someday. Uh, but you refuse to let me talk. You refuse to let me take action. <laughs> Mommy, please forgive me. What? Please, Daddy, please forgive me. He's already crying and sweating. Sorry. Mom, please let it be a thing of the past. Please. Just, just let it go for peace to reign. How could we? He loved you. Mommy, please don't cry. Why please. are you doing this? What is it? Have you forgiven me? Joshua, I have forgiven you, but what do you want? What have we not done? Can't you just be a better person? What stops you? What is stopping you? Can't you love your siblings? Are you not satisfied with what you're getting here? Do you want me to lie on the floor before you know that I love you? What else can a mother do that I've not given you? I just should Yes. Yes, Mr. Osorio. What? My son? How? Where? Okay, okay. He has head and hand injuries. He was unconscious when he was brought here. 
But right now he's out of danger. You will be fine. Please excuse me. She is very, very lucky to be alive. Two girls. And one of the boys died on the spot of that accident. Died? Honestly. Since he got this his money, eh, he has been reckless and wild. I don't know why. Hmm. I don't know what got into him. Uh, but if you ask me, sweetheart, I will tell you that Uche has always been that way. Mm -hmm. The money just brought out the hidden part of him. I believe you. He has not been treating his father and the younger sister Choma fairly. That's bad. Eh? Always antagonizing and uh, criticizing the father for not being a millionaire. What? I'm telling you. That is foolishness if you ask me. Is he a small boy? He's a graduate of five years. How would he be criticizing his father? <sighs> I just... Uh, I just hope he gets well soon. He'll be fine. The doctor said he'll be fine. Honestly, I don't know why all, almost all the four sons of the family are spoiled. So spoiled and rebellious. First sons? Honestly, look at Uche. Mm. Have you forgotten that I am one? Mm? Yes, I'm the first child of my parents. Don't even go there. Your case is different. Good. You grew up in a military home. Your father was a soldier. So there are things you don't try at so, home. So, my father was a soldier and so? You know you can't try so many things at home <laughs> at your age then. See that, let me tell you. Anybody who wants to spoil, uh -huh. will spoil. Please. If you like, place a gun on his head. Don't even start. I'm telling you. Don't even start. I was just a good Oh, oh please stop. And ended up a gentleman. Ah, which gentleman? <laughs> which gentleman? Have you forgotten you know, where we met? Where did we meet? Hey! Where? Rex! 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 Tell me. We met during our final year in secondary school. Yes. In a party. Uh huh. Have you forgotten? Okay, I it remember. It was your now. time to sing a song. Mm -hmm. And you started crying almost. Oh. That your father is going to kill you. You jumped a fence to be in the party and nobody will kill. Yes. Stop, please. That means I, I, I was a good boy who had a fear of his parents and fear of God. Good boy yes. who jumped fence to be in a party. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And you fell in love with that young man oh, who jumped fence. Don't even start. <laughs> Don't go there. You fell in love with you that with the fence, fence jumping young man. You fell in love with ah, him. Please. <laughs> Yeah, Frank Walter, I've been waiting to hear from you now. Eh? How far now? Pay me my money back. What you can't talk about now, Franco? How can you be asking me such, such stupid question? I just came back from hospital after paying so much bills. And I've been calling you and not picking your call. The last bill was my father that paid it. You did not show any atom of concern. You did not even visit me. Guy, please, pay me my money. Yes, now. 
Pay me my money. Is, is that my business? Now, what do you want me to do? Which property? Franco. 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 So you know business like this. You came to me to borrow money, Abi. You know investment very well. You can't borrow your money from me, Abi. What? Franco borrowed money from me to fence his land. To God who made me. Uche, you have finished your life. I. Gosh. Can you imagine? Hey. This Franco boy. Father was advising me, I refused to listen. Can you imagine 50 million naira just gone like that? I am not penniless. No one naira. Car finished. Hey. Hey. To God who made me, Uche, you are finished. Oh, no. Thank you. That is serious. Dad, really I want to apologize to you for the stress I've been making you pass through all these years. Honestly, now I know and understand better. I um, honestly, honestly want to ask for your forgiveness because um, my experiences this few months have actually taught me a hardcore bitter lesson. My son, I am very happy that you finally realized yourself and uh, have decided to turn a new leaf. To be honest, you see, I, I believe that God allowed you to pass through this phase and come out of it alive, untouched, unhurt for a very good reason. Thank you, Dad. Um, Dad, that's this my old classmate I met yesterday. Really, the guy is doing very well. He's working in a company and he's doing real good. He has a car. He has a, he's married with to key and he's staying in a five bedroom duplex. Really? Not like all those my old friends that believe that uh, if they don't do ritual or do any bad business, they won't make money. You see what I've been telling you? This is exactly my point. I've been telling you that if you have a good job, or you do a legitimate business, you will be able to live a good life. But you never believed me. Yeah, but I'm happy that uh, you've seen it for yourself. This is what I have gone through now. I am going to take my certificate, dust it up, 
start looking for jobs because I want to work now. I think I've been taking it, uh, I've been playing with it. I've not been serious about it. That's what I'm going to do now. I want to thank you, sir. Thank you, my son. Thank you, sir. I'm happy you realized yourself. Thank you, Daddy. Uh, uh, come on, you sure you don't want to take? I want you to help me and talk to Choma. She is the woman I truly love. I want to make her my woman. I want to marry her. Well, Jerry, you know that uh, Choma is a grown-up girl. She's the one that would determine what is best for her. But for talking to her, I will still put in a word or two as her elder brother. Yeah, that's see. what I mean, as the elder brother. Eh? I want you to put in a word or two. I know she will listen to you. All I promise you and your father, I will make sure I bring it on. Eh? No, there's no problem. I will talk to her like I promise you. I'll make nice sure one. that I, I, I put in one or two. You understand? Nice one. I will not disappoint you people. Eh? I, you, uh, you people are good people. So who would dream of doing bad to you? If not that fool, laugh him. Eh? Let me tell you, he's a devil from the pit of hell. All the shame that you has brought to your family, I will clean it up. I promise you that I will clean it up. I yes. will. I will. I will try my best. Mm. Check I'll it try my best. Go to I need a quick one here, man. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. A thousand dollars. You know, you may go and exchange it into the map. Five. So that's uh, five hundred sixty thousand. Nine. Well, yes. Mm. Mm. I will talk to her. Okay, it's okay. Mm. I, I will. I will make sure that. Uh, she responds. It's fine. It's yes. fine. It's fine. I will not disappoint you. No. Uh, anytime you're less busy, I can take you out. We'll move around. No eh? problem. Gaga Cruz, only a good day. A good day. I'll see you. Take care. Take care. <laughs> when I think it's over, when I think I've lost all, that is when God says, calm down. When I think I'm a nobody, when I think my world has crumbled, that is when... Oh, yes. Ah. <laughs> what will be, will be. Hmm? Your daughter Choma and I has been on this for long. Oh, yes. If not for that, uh, that devil that wanted to shatter our life. Thank God that we are here. All their plans failed. Huh? We are happy again and from now, good things will kick off from here. Uh, it's all right. Uh, you're welcome. Thank you. As you know, I love my daughter so dearly. Mm -hmm. Therefore, I am willing to support anything that will make her happy. Papa, you don't need to worry yourself, okay? Oh yes, because I am Mr. Happiness. Uh huh. I will make your daughter happy. She will not lack. I have everything that she needs. Once we marry, everything Jabba for her to enjoy herself. Hmm? Do not worry yourself. If not for the little misunderstanding that we had because of that devil that wanted to put things off, we don't have been here talking of this. She will enjoy. I will make sure she enjoys. Eh? And you will enjoy too, as my father-in-law. You know, um, by weekend, I'll be going back to the States. Oh yes, oh yes. And uh, your daughter will join me soon. Because I will soon come back and the uh, marriage process starts. After the marriage, the daughter follows me back to the States. I'll give her money for international passport. Once she's done, visa, visa processing starts off. And from there, we'll go back to America. Well, it's all right. Um, I wish you a safe journey when you travel. Okay? Thank you. All right. Thank you. Well, Papa, I will leave you guys here. Hmm? Let me go and see some friends. 
This is for you. Abumo make a kuro. He will take his work. His work again, make a kuro. Thank you. Odugu, join me to the car. I'm free again. But what can't you put it here? I can't see me. I can't look. Say that. Get your things. I'll wait for you here so that we'll go, right? No. Jerry, no. You can't keep saying no, right? I need to feel you. Uh, I, I, let's go home. No, we agreed to do the right thing before anything. I mean, you only did the introduction, not even bride price payment. Hey, babe, we are doing the right thing, right? You're my wife. I know, but you know, I can, I can pay up everything. Jerry, I can do anything. We finish everything before anything. We agreed. Please. Fine. You win, right? You win. Huh? Anything for you, baby. You know I can do anything for you. I know. Alright. Well, um, I have something for you. Oh yes, sir. Uh, this is for your international passport. Oh, oh, the passport. Uh, yes, it's much. Do the international passport. Whatever that remains, keep it for yourself. Use that clean up the bit. Thank you. <laughs> um, I need it again. Because I want to take it to America. Hmm? I know. When you get to America, you know you're not going to say no. Stop! <laughs> I you said nice to see my dad. And they said I should take it up. Okay, mm -hmm. alright, sure. Oh, uh, you yeah, know, when you get to America. Oh, stop! <laughs> okay. Alright. What's wrong? Why Shut did you up. listen? Now listen to me. You can hate me for telling the truth. But I don't care. All I know is that the truth must always be told. So this, don't mind what I told mommy and daddy. When I told them that I was joking. Emeka, it is not a joke. It is real. They know the truth. The truth is everywhere, but they will not tell you because they don't want you to feel isolated. How dare you? How dare you? If you start your nonsense again today, I swear to God, I will deal with you. 
I do not care if you're my senior brother or not. You are mad. You have lost your respect. You are stupid for this thing you just said, if you don't know. Something is wrong with your head. Oh, you feel because they've said you are the only one that has been achieving a lot of things. Like, respect yourself. Let me put you through this whole thing so that it will be very clear to you because you're still a very small boy. Go and bring your birth certificate. Open it. Compare your birth certificate, everything written inside, with ours. Number one, we have a family hospital. Two, we have a family doctor. The three legitimate and bona fide children of this family were born in the same hospital by the same doctor. Why is your own different? Have you not asked yourself? Have you not? Now let me tell you, to show that you're stupid, you had the guts to insult a legitimate and a bona fide first son of this family. Now, if you check those things, you will see that you don't belong here. For your information, I am not saying it because I want you to pack your things and run away. Mm -mm. Or if you run away, the better for you and I. Because as a legitimate and the bona fide first son of this family, very soon, power will change hands. And by then, I will give you the place you are supposed to be in this family. So if you run away, the better. But all I want you to know is, you were picked by... You miserable beast. Emika, you slapped me. I slapped you. You had the mind. Hey, I will keep you in this house. You wanted war. Eh? Now taste war. You had the yes. mind to slap me, Emika. Yes, I slapped you. You slapped I me. I slapped you. Stop, 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 Hello? Hello? He was one of the stupid African bitches Jerry's deceiving her. Listen and listen good, okay? Jerry's been married to me since seven years now. We got two kids, Max and Vera. You better be used to yourself and forget about him. He's an ungrateful asshole. And he's going nowhere. If he tries to leave me, I would finish him off, okay? Just get into your silly bush brain, alright? And don't ever I repeat, don't you ever call this number again. Who is this? Hello? All of our life is so deep. All of our life is so wide. All of our life is so mysterious. Be careful. All of our... Gee, what is it? Gee, I don't know. I don't know. Someone just called me now. I'm using your phone saying she's Jerry's wife and she has two children that he's married. With Jerry? With Jerry, Jerry. Your husband? Yes. How can Jerry... I don't know. Who? A woman or a man? I don't know. A woman. It's a woman. She's a woman. Jerry? Yes. Has a wife? Yes, yes. And two children. Two children? Yes, yes. What's going on? I don't know, I don't know. Come back. Hmm? Come back, you know. You can never know all these guys. It's even better that we are getting to know all these things now. Before tomorrow, he will marry you and everything will expose. Do you understand? Because some of these guys that claim they are abroad, they will come, deceive girls, that they want to marry, the girls will put all their heart with them and they will disappoint them. No, sis. It's okay. Nothing has spoiled yet. Thank God it happened this early. You are a beautiful woman with the whole world ahead of you. See, 
if this one spoils, let it spoil. A man that is for you will come to you, that will love you. And when that man comes, who will even love you? When I think it's over, oh, she wait, when I think oh, I'm she wait, so I should, okay, I'm fine, I'm fine. No, what? God says, huh? calm down. I just need to hear the When I think I'm a nobody, Gigi, when down. I think my oh. world has crumbled, we don't know this guy. That is when God rests on oh, me. Yeah. This naming ceremony is sweet. Ah, exhausting. You really tried though. Honestly. I wasn't ah. expecting this much. Mm, mm. They tried. They tried. Wow. Two jokes um, again. Uh, Jamaica, you are uh, here. Joshua. Mom. I demand a DNA test. What? You heard me right. For the past two days of your absence, Joshua has presented me with clear evidence that you're not my parents. Again? Joshua, again? And you're still falling for that? Who can... Joshua! Joshua! Come here! Joshua! What did you tell this young man in our Me? How? Have I seen you today? Did you, did you discuss anything today? It's not today! What did you tell him? <laughs> Dad, there's really no need. Of course, just try to lie as usual. I don't even feel like I belong to this family anymore. I need a DNA test. I demand it. DNA test? What for? But wait, I, 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 let me understand something. Emeka, are you indirectly trying to say that our mother was once so faithful. Joshua! Mama, this is very critical. How can he, without respect, no one are you without respect? He doesn't have He stands before you and that. He must be humiliated. And indirectly, he is saying that you, our mother, was unfaithful. Ah, uh, no. You see, of course. Dad, Mom, you see it? You see the result of overpumping this boy. See? No respect. It doesn't matter anymore. It really doesn't matter anymore. I've made up my mind. It's either a DNA test or I'll do something really terrible. Or you tell me the truth. Yes. Don't even talk. Sweetheart. Mom, I, I am not your yes, sweet. Don't call me that. Just, I, I need the truth. Please. Honey, you see this joke? It has gotten out of hand and I think it is time we get this done and dusted. I can't take this anymore. I can't. America, you want a DNA test, isn't it? Isn't it? You will get it. We are going to get a DNA test so that this matter will be let to rest permanently once and for all. Yes. Yes. We are going for a DNA test. I'm going to arrange for it and then I'm going to communicate to you on the time, date and venue. Let everybody be prepared. Thank you. But that, you better give me that DNA test. Too. I'm not. I, you, 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 are still, you don't even have respect. You are still talking. Joshua, get out. Uh, Mom, help me. Get out. Joshua, get out.
Brother Amy, food is ready. The let's go and eat. Brother Amy, you can't starve yourself, you know. Ada, just, just go away. I, I'm, I'm not hungry. Brother Amy, you've not eaten anything since yesterday. Everyone has begged you, but you refused. Do you want to develop Pulsa? Pulsa? It doesn't matter. I want to die right now. So just, just leave me alone. God forbid. You're my brother and nothing can change that. I'm your brother. But you were there when Josh called me a stranger. And what did you do? What did you do at that? You walked out on me. And you're calling me your brother. Shusha was blackmailing me with lies. Lies that I was going around with boys on the street, which is a lie. <sighs> I thought he was going to tell our parents. And you couldn't confide in me and you call me your brother. Why didn't you tell me? I didn't think of it. Everything happened so fast. I'm so sorry I betrayed you, brother. Well, it doesn't matter anymore. And I'm not your brother. Don't call me your brother until the DNA test is out, please. Just, just leave me alone right I now. I don't care about any test. Nothing can stop my loving you as a brother. Just go, just just go. It doesn't matter anymore. Just just leave me alone. You called yourself my sister. Just just and you betrayed me. Just leave me. Just leave me alone right now. I want to be alone. Please. I'm, I'm sorry. Just, just, just go. Just, just go. Just go. Please. Just leave me alone. Just go. Just go. <laughs> God is the hope to the hopeless, never you cry again, he has your future in his plan, wipe your tears away, wipe your tears away, God's on time. Doctor, you know, you know it's not easy for a man to decide to take his entire family for a DNA test. Yes. Um, there is a critical issue in my family that I need to resolve. It's a long story, but uh, let me just do this. Let me just do it. It's going to help me, at least to prevent uh, future disaster. It's alright, um, you know, it's uh, only a man that uh, decides how to go about his problems. Exactly. But I'll still advise that you take it easy, whatever it is. Oh, oh sure, sure, yes, yeah. I, um, <laughs> it took me time to come to this decision, so it's something I'm doing consciously. I'm fine. Uh, we are going to require blood samples of each member of the family. Then, uh, of course, the payment. No problem. No problem. I'll, I'll make the payments. You already told me about the bill. No problem. Yeah, I'll take care of that. I will arrange for family members for their blood sample. I will determine what I'm going to do with individually or collectively. I'll take care of that. But before long, you'll get uh, what you need. Yeah. You get the blood samples. Okay, I, I hope um, your hospital accepts. Oh uh, uh, yeah, 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 sir. I will, um, I will send you the hospital details. Okay, okay. It's not, it's not, it's not going to be a problem. Yeah. That's alright. Okay. We'll do it. Alright, okay. Doctor Pratt. Alright, my friend. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Right. So I'm expecting the message. I will send you the details. Yes, sir. I will send it. That's alright. And uh, please, you take it easy. Oh, I'm fine. I'm fine. Yes. Thank you. Go ahead. So the 
ugly You might think You've made it through Never offend The innocent Because God knows the best way To fight back Oh This one. What's, what's your name? Hey. Excuse me. Huh? What, what's your name? Mister, what is it now? Yeah. What is your business here? Eh? Sorry for yourself. Uh-uh. Oga, please, can you go? Leave now. Uh-uh. Sure. Please get out of this place, sir. Get out. Woman rapper. When they bring you down to the mall, when you see many heartbreaks, be silent and wait for God. I guess uh, you are here for the interview. Why are you not inside with us? Yes, I'm here for the interview. Um, inside, too much distraction. I just came out to go through some things that will help me for the interview. Oh, uh, all right. Uh, my name is uh, Obina Urakwe. Nice meeting you. Hi. My name is Uche Osondo. Uh, Oh, well, you see, for me, I'm very skeptical about these people. I hope they're going to pay well. Because me, I'm looking for a job that will pay very well. Well, for me, I'm not here for the pay. I'm actually uh, interested in uh, a company that will uh, give me an opportunity to work, help me to rise in my skills and uh, knowledge. Not really necessarily for the fat pay. Mm, that's interesting. Yes, if I was an employer, what I would do is I would look for people that will help uh, share my company's uh, grow vision, you know, help the company to grow, not necessarily people that will come looking for the pace. Because if the pay is not there, they will run. Hmm. Oh, did you say your name was Uchi Osondo? Yes, Uchi Osondo. Why? Oh, you know, anytime I hear that name, Osondo, it rings a bell. Brings back memories. Wow. Really? Yes. You see, there used to be a man called uh, Edwin Osondo. He played a major role when I was born, a vital role in my life. Edwin. If not for that, yeah, Edwin. If not for that man, I would have been a school dropout. Wow. He's just a sport. Do you know my father bears that same name, Edwin Osondo? Yeah, uh, the Edwin Osondo I'm talking about. He owned a big shop in my streets. But uh, when I came back from boarding school, I had his shop got burnt and he relocated. For 20 years, I have been trying to look for this man. Nobody knows his whereabouts. Do you know what? My father used to own a shop at Yetunde Street, number 17 Yetunde Street, if I can remember. Yeah, 17 Yetunde Street. 
in Lawrence's Sunuri, Lagos. The shop also got bombed. We relocated. <laughs> Wait a minute. You mean number 17, getting the allowance? Yes. What, what talking about the same man? Okay. If, wow. you, if you see the man, will you recognize him? Of course I will. Well, I have his photo on my phone. Let me show you. That, that's him. Yes. With the white bears. That is him. Are you sure? Of course. Though it's a long time, but I still recognize his face. Oh. Is he still alive? What is that? Do you want to kill my father? I'm telling you, I live with him in the same house. He asked me, is he still alive? He's alive now. Okay, don't worry. After the interview, we'll all go together. Come on. Please, I need to see him now. Now, listen, I, I need to see Daddy now. He means everything to me. Please. Daddy, what? Yes. Guy, calm down. We are here for an interview. Well, we are done. I agree. I'll take you to the house. Come on, come on. You, know you really just goes. understand who this man is. To. Listen, I can't wait for another second. He's my second God. He made me who I am today. Please. Okay, let's go. Come on, trust. Please, please. I just need to see him. Right? I need to see Daddy now. Now. Seeing him now will benefit you more than this interview. Yes. Right, that's that's that. Come on, come on. Please, please. Trust me. Trust me, believe me. Please, let's go. Let me ask you, sorry. Is this your car? Oh, oh, no, no. Actually, my friend's car. He traveled abroad and he told me to be using it on his back. Huh? Yeah. It's a nice one. Come on, stop the You might think. Uh, I'm so sorry, baby. I'm not lying to you. I cannot lie to you. Uh, yes, I will lie. Uh, she's my friend. But uh, she wanted marriage. I told her no. That I have a beautiful angel wedding for me back at home. I cannot lie to you. She she just cooked up that. You are such a liar. What about the children? She mentioned their names. Uh, uh, ma ma there is no child. You know a woman, if she says that I have a child, you will run. I will, I will not lie to you. Why will I lie to you? I don't have a, She's just my friend. I met her. We have not even uh, had anything for over just a few months ago. I, I just met her a few. I, I won't lie to are you. Are you telling me the truth? I'm telling you the truth, baby. Trust me. I won't lie to you. Trust me. Okay? You're the only one I have. You are the, you are the one I want to make my woman. Right? I'm scared because she sounded... Trust me. I won't fail you. Okay? Yes. So, let's go because I don't want your father to meet me here. Oh, yeah, let me let me let me call him. Okay. Tell him. Hello, Dad. I'm fine. I'm just stepping out for a while. I am fine. I just wanted to let you know. Okay, bye. My baby, you know I won't fail you. Hmm? My outstanding. I love it.
put it. Oh, you mean this is your house? Yes, this is where I stay. This is my family house. Why do you ask? Oh, oh never mind. Never mind. Okay. Just sit. Should I get you something to drink? Oh, no, 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 I'm fine. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm right. Okay, thank you. Just a minute. Okay. Papa! Are you done with the interview? Uh, something came up. Somebody wants to see you urgently. Somebody? Who is it? Uh, I don't know him. I met him at the interview venue. He said that if you see him, you'd know him. Hmm. A man? Yes. He said that uh, you helped him uh, years back. Really? Yeah. I know I've helped a lot of people in the past. Who could this be? Uh, it's alright. So, where is he now? He's waiting in front. It's alright. Let's go and see him. That it's you. That it's me, Obina. Obina, Obina used to pay his school fees and feeding money before I went for boarding school. Come on. Ah, Obina! Yes, Obina. Ah, that Obina. I found you. This is you. Thank God, yes, this is me. This is me. I can't believe this. <laughs> ah, that's it. Ah, I've been looking for you. Obina! I can't believe this. <laughs> I told you. I told you. I told you. Hey. <sighs> this is me. Ah. Oh so how is everything? I'm fine. I'm fine. When I came back from school, I set for you for these 20 years. Yeah. And I was told your shop got burnt. My son. It's a long story. Everything I worked for. Yeah, yeah. Well, I'm, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Dad. All right, see. After my secondary school, I got a scholarship, went to UK to study, did my first degree, did my master's degree. After school, I was working, I got a job, I worked for some time, and I decided to come back home. Because I met him at the interview. We got talking, and here I am today. I found you. Thank you. You're still alive and so strong, my son. <laughs> we thank God for everything. Eh? Thank God for everything. And I'm so happy that you've progressed so much. Ah. Eh? <laughs> to tell you the truth, I knew you were going to make it. Ah, that's <laughs> so, thank you. Yeah, so thank tell you, me. You, you mean you attended the same interview that my son went for? Eh? I mean, what a coincidence. Oh, yes. Uh, <clears throat> Dad, not as an applicant, but the one recruiting people. I like recruiting people in my company. You mean your company? Oh, yes. You are the owner of the company? Yes. I am the CEO of Cutting Edge Technology. But you, you told me... Oh, yes. I have a unique way of employing people in my company. All I do is dress like an applicant, mix up with them, so I'll be able to fish out dedicated ones. Hmm? Wait a minute. Are you saying you are the owner of the company? Yes, the parent company is in the UK and we are the best in blue chip technology. But you, you told me... Uh, oh, yes, yes, yes. I was just putting your leg. The car is mine. It's one of my fleet. I have a house in Lekki and a mini estate in Aja. Well, Father, God has really blessed me so much. Indeed. God has been wonderful. It's been wonderful indeed. Why are we still standing? Standing? 
I know you must have gone through a lot these few years. My son, it's been tough. Really tough. Like you knew, I, I lost everything to that fire. Okay? And after the shop got burnt, we had no option but to relocate to the village temporarily. We stayed there for a while and uh, we decided to come back to start again, you know. Well, I tried my best. I was able to put up this little structure you see here. And um, things were picking up. All of a sudden, nature struck. My wife fell sick, so sick, she had uh, cancer of the pancreas and she suffered for a very long time. Well, I used everything I had to try to make her live. Unfortunately, she died. I'm sorry. So sorry about everything that happened. Sorry. But don't worry. Best of my ability, I will turn things around. Yeah, you see, all my life I never experienced fatherly love until I met you. If not for you, I will be nobody today. It's time for me to reciprocate. I will do everything possible to take care of you. And I will make sure my company places you on a retirement salary until the end of your days. Eh? Wow, yes. <laughs> Thank uh, you. Not just that. Then for you, consider yourself past the interview. What? Yes. <laughs> not only that, get ready. I'm flying you abroad before I start. Oh, wow. <laughs> thank you very much. Thank you. Oh, thank you very much. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. You have to thank our daddy. If not for him, I will be nobody today. Hmm? Look, my son, I am so happy for this moment. I never conceived in my wildest imagination that something like this will happen one day. You know? <laughs> yes. Yes, thank God. See, thank God thank I really you. had no option, no. I had no option. There is no way I could have allowed you to drop out of school knowing that you you were so brilliant and well behaved. Ah. Eh? <laughs> eh? Thank you, Dad. No, sure. Thank you. Thank you, Dad. Oh, oh, yes, Dad. Oh, like you said, good name and good deed are the best assets anyone can possess. You're very correct. <laughs> oh. Um. Yeah, hello? Yes, you can carry on with the interview. Yeah, make sure you shortlist the best candidates for a later day. Or, oh, for real? Okay, okay. I'll be there in Jiffy. All right. Yeah, that, that is my human capital development manager. Yeah, uh, he said my foreign partners are in my office. I need to see them because they are leaving the country tonight. That means you can go. All right, so yes. um, I'll be back. Sorry. I'll be back. All right. All right. <laughs> you see him off, eh? All right, sir. Okay. I'll be back soon. Right. Uh, <laughs> let's take a selfie. Okay. Mm. okay. <laughs> All right. Uh. 
Everybody say cheese. <laughs> okay, right. I'll be back soon. Ah. <laughs> this picture is fine now. No, it's, it's beautiful. It's, ah, fantastic. Hey, I can't believe this is happening. Hmm. Eh? Hey, look, Uchi, we have to prepare something delicious for him before he comes back. Well, well, eh? well, well. Hey. Hey. Wait, where is Choma? Dad, I should be asking you where is Choma. Ah, did she go? Ah, oh, sorry, my bad. She told me she was going out briefly. Uh, she'll be back soon. She's missing her big time. A lot. <laughs> She's missing a lot. <laughs> Hi! It's Uche. That's very beautiful, though. Oh, God. Let's go, let's go. This is too much. <laughs> Just the twinkle of an eye. God is a wonder. God is a wonder. Hello, baby. <laughs> Surprise! Winnie! Winnie, how are you? Very well. When did you arrive? This morning. Uh, do you have a program in Nigeria? Not really. I flew in to see you. Oh, you're welcome. Thanks, but not thanks. Come on. Winnie, what is the problem? You're not looking happy? Am I supposed to be happy? You abandoned me for a long time in London and you don't reply my test up more of taking my calls. Oh, oh, come on, I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry about that. But you see, since I came back, I have been so busy. Very busy trying to put things together. Spare me such lies, okay? Look, I know what's up. I guess you are hooked up with local girl here. You want to abandon me? <laughs> that would happen. Okay? I won't allow such thing to happen. Come, come on, it's, it's not what you think. What am I supposed to think? Now, Obi, now, what am I supposed to think? Gee. <laughs> ah, why are you looking excited, Oh, my God. A movie just happened here today. Did you see one guy that just drove out now? Yes, it was in such a hurry. Yeah, that's his picture. My this dear. is the guy that just drove out? I swear to God. The guy had just come to change our entire family story. Um, Uche, you're speaking in parables. I don't understand. Listen, what just happened to here today is not something to be told while standing. Now I believe in Father's goodness. I swear to God. He's calling me. I'm... Excuse me. Hello? That's so deadly. Hello? You might think Hello. you've made it through. Never offend the innocent. Wickedness does not pay, but has a way to bounce back. Think twice before you do. Cast us is our way of everything. All about life is so deep. All about life is so wide. All about life is so mysterious. Be careful.
I'm sorry to see this. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, oh, uh, my name is Obina. You, Chema. Oh, Chema, sweet name. Oh, oh I can see you at the show. It consists. I just finished actually. Oh, for real? Congratulations. Thank you. <laughs> That's good. Ah, uh, if you don't mind, can you join me for lunch? Um, no, I, I just got back and I can't wait to see my brother and my dad. Are oh, you still going to see them after the lunch? I just can't. It's been a while I've seen them, so I'm going to see them. Oh. You like uh, Congo music? No, no I'm, 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 I'm just going to my mind I should call him I lost his card that was him it was him Alright, you know what? I have some personalities in my office I need to attend to right now, okay? What you do, you follow me to my office, you sit down. When I'm done with them, we can talk it out, okay? No way! So we're discussing this right now and right here! Honey, we had a perfect relationship in the UK, didn't we? No, we were just friends. We're not just friends, we were lovers. That happened long time ago, even before I left the UK. Okay? Obina, when you were hungry in UK, I gave you food. When you were homeless, I gave you home. When you were lonely, I gave you company. And now this? Come on, you are ridiculous. Okay? I was never hungry nor homeless. Yes! You chose to assess me, which I actually appreciated. But listen to me, don't forget. I came to UK with scholarship. Left my fiance because of you. Because you chose to do that. I had no commitment with you. Why are you such an ungrateful wretch? Listen, I am not an ungrateful wretch. Oh yes, wretch. you are. Honey, what is your problem? Come on. Now, now, okay, fine. Now, listen to me. Like I told you before, I have some personalities in my office. I need to attend to them right now because it's very, very important. When I'm done with them, at least we can continue from where we stop. Okay? Listen, honey. I flew into the country to come and see you. Now you're telling me I'm not important? You're telling me this to my face? I never said so. Oh, you did! Please stop, stop putting words in my mouth. I never said you're not important. 
I only told you I have some personality in the office that I need to attend to right now. Okay? So let me finish and when I'm, when I'm done, you... I, it, it, it's okay. I understand. Let me remind you, darling, that hell knows no fury than a woman scorned. You can go ahead and see your important people. But whatever you see later, you're ready to take it. Oh, is that a threat? Oh no. I can't possibly threat you. With my lips, excuse me. Oh, please, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for the latest incident. It was a... Uh, the woman was just jealous. She was a desperate woman that wanted to gun me down. Huh? You know about all this Oibo, how they do. She wasn't my wife. There was no children at all. Well, she even came up and said that it was a prank. I apologized to Choma and she accepted my apologies. Huh? Please, I'm so sorry for everything. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Where are you here to go to her? Huh? How will I marry someone that is old? Someone that is uh, sorry, saving up to uh, uh, for something years, close to 50 years. Don't know, there is nothing like that. Please, I'm sorry. Find a place in your heart and forgive and let's move on. Oh yes, the project I told you about, we discussed about. I will help you. Yes, just find a way and uh, resubmit the proposal to, to my email. I'll fix it up for you. Oh yes, I'll finance it from beginning to the end. Huh? But how would you do to a honor? No coupon. Let's let's forget about all these things. It's just that you know you wanna try about it. I'm not going to walk away wisdom. Hmm. my God. And forgive me, okay? Let's uh, move on. I will marry your daughter, and I will give you guys the best. I have what it takes. I'm a good man. Hmm? Ago, if you are a man, I should understand. Ago. Ago. You are a man. I did watch you. Peter Wuke. I'm watching you. Peter Wuke. Huh? Uh, Papa, let me go and change your mind. Yes. I am taking my time to explain all this because DNA tests have led to several tragedies in many families. We have seen people commit suicide due to the shock of discovering that a child they thought was theirs actually belonged to someone else. Some men have had to kill their wives and even the children have also discovered. But our professional position is that such actions are absolutely unnecessary. In fact, they are reprehensible. Sometimes a woman may be pregnant by another man before the wedding will have married. Besides, there are so many reasons why a woman might fall for such temptation. But that should not be the end of life. Nor should it be a reason for anyone to do outrageous things. You see, no one has a right to take the life of a spouse, especially on account of infidelity. No, because only God has life. Life belongs to God.
Baby, I'm sorry for the other day, for the white threatening you. I'm sorry, I was, I was just upset. Okay? Okay, okay, fine. Mm, I know these girls will be throwing themselves at you guys once you come back from abroad. Especially when you got some pounds and dollars. Sweetheart, and some is straight. Are you engaged to any girls on here? Oh, no, not at all. That means I came in at the right time. Sweetheart, I've got all you need in a woman. Beauty, brain, and of course money. I have a budding career and my social standing is high up there. That's exactly what you need to get to the zenith of your career and your business. Okay? We'll get married and raise a first class family. We can aspire to any level of life. As a matter of fact, we can aspire to the presidency of this country and it will be a done deal. Yes. Okay? With me beside you, Just like Barack Obama and Mitchell. Isn't that beautiful, darling? Oh, yes. Yes. Uh, oh, that would be nice. That would be more than nice. It will be a bomb. Oh. <laughs> thank you, darling. Thank you, thank you. I love you. I love you so much. Okay? Ah! ah. <laughs> so how are you? Oh, how are you? <laughs> nice to see you. Yeah. How are you? Um, meet uh, Jerry, my sister's fiance. Uh, you already know that. Uh, of course. Well, uh, well this is uh, Obina, my father's uh, long lost son. We just got uh, reunited after 20 years. Alright, see, so like. Uh, uh no not really but um, it's a long story uh, gentlemen and lady of course it's an interesting one eh? let us go over there and get ourselves well introduced huh eh? it's a long story but very interesting all right no shall problem. we <laughs> so what nice to see you <laughs> So, whatever the result of this DNA test, I would advise for restaurant and maturity. No one goes to the grave with his children, his own children. I can have this neck. I'm sure some people have adopted and raised other people's children and lived happily with them. So what will I get for uh, you? Uh, nothing. Uh, sorry, excuse me. Are you not uh, Jerry Maxwell? Oh, uh, yes. Do I know you? Oh, yeah. I ran into your cousin some time ago and she gave me an update about you. Well, she told me you're not happily married. Two kids. Uh, uh, what? Yes. She even showed me your family photograph. Eh? Well, congratulations. Uh, uh, excuse me. Excuse me. Please. Excuse me. Um, uh, excuse me. My cousin Jane said that. Yes. Oh, she even told me uh, you're trying to get married to a Nigerian woman that will take care of your mother. Yes. Who are you, please? Come on, don't tell me you don't recognize me. Obina, your cousin. The same Obina you grew up with. Obina, my cousin. Yes. Oh, really? Where have you been and what are you doing here? Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah, I discovered my long lost father after so many years. He sponsored my education throughout secondary school before I got a scholarship to go study abroad. Fortunately, 
we got reunited yesterday. Oh, oh, really? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> oh, it's been a while. I've been. I'm. Um, oh, oh, okay. I'm. I'm. I'm so sorry for all that we did to you, right? My mother and I. You know, we were kids then, so I'm sorry. My mother was the one that instigated and instructed me to do all I did to you. I'm sorry, bro. Oh, come on, it's all right. It's all right. Huh? It's of the past now. Long time. So, uh, how is your mother now? She's fine, Obina. She's fine. She's down with stroke. But she'll be fine. In no distant time, uh, she's picking up. In no distant time, she'll be fine, right? Sorry about that. All right. Uh, so, Papa, how's it been? Jerry. Yeah. You and I need to talk to her. Okay. Okay. What the? Jen, Jen, light, right? I, I'm coming. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I hope there's no problem. Uchi. At what point were you going to tell me? I knew there was something off about you. Uh, I knew and I asked God to expose you and he just exposed you. Not really, babe. I, I was desperate. Because I love you. No, you, and don't I love you. Love no, no, you don't. You were desperate because you wanted to put me into slavery by getting me pregnant and making me take care of your mother. Hey, okay, babe, it's not like that, okay? Then how is it? You want to concoct another lie? How is it? Come on, what's the big deal? Hey, yes, what's the big deal, Dad? Do you want to join me to Australia? Huh? Will you stand my Australian wife? Oh, you have the F on to scream? You? Who lied? You are angry? Whatever I call Listen, all you have to do now is get into your car and leave here before my brother descends on you mercilessly at that. The world is a game. You have to get yours to win. I have here with me the results of uh, four of your children. This is for Ada Madoka. It is positive. She is your child. This one is for Chijioke. Chijioke Madoka. Uh, positive. Your child. Where we have problems with these two results, Emeka and Joshua. One is positive, one is negative. Father, I have another surprise. Obina, what surprise again now? Haven't I had enough surprises for just one day? Well, I have been to this house before. Yes, I came to this house twice. You? Yes. When? For what? Yes, uh, earlier this year, I gave a lady in the youth corps uniform a ride on my way back from Ibadan. battle. Yes, I still remember. I dropped her at the gate. I did everything possible to get her number, but she refused. And I gave her my card for her to call me. She was so behaved that I had to come back. After waiting for a long time, she didn't call me. I came back to this same house, got to the gate, knocked, nobody answered. So I left. 
Obina, are you sure is this house you're talking about? Oh, uh, yes. I'm very sure. Very, very sure. Yes, he's sure, Dad. Because I was the one he dropped off. This is negative. This child doesn't share the same DNA with you. Therefore, it can be your son. Doctor, which of my children are you talking about? Emigrant's result is positive. It is your child. Or your first son, Joshua. His is negative. He is not your son. Man, I'm not done yet. Sit down. Sit the back. This is my office. Sit down. I'm so sorry I misplaced your card. I mean, you had already told me that if things changed, I should call. But I had lost your card, so. Sorry. Has it changed now? I rather say. Yes, I, I mean, you saved me from a fraud. A fraud star. Uh, what? Let's see. God saved you for me. Hello? What is going on here? I don't understand anything anymore. Me too. What is going on? Oh, uh, Father. I am in love with Joma. That is what is going on here. Yes. Yes. Yeah, my love. Since the last time I dropped you at that gate, I bought a gift and I kept it inside my car permanently for a moment like this. Give me a few minutes, I'll be back. Oh, he told me that day he liked me. I, I don't Jeremy. know. What I do not understand is the fact that this child's DNA does not match with your wife's DNA. Therefore, she is not his mother. Excuse me, doctor! Is there something I need to know? You, you idiot! You cost of this. Shut up and sit down. We are not done yet. Sit down. Yes, yes. 
Shoma. What is happening? Am I dreaming or what? That was the gentleman I told you dropped me off at the gate the day I got back from service. So he told me he liked me and then he gave me his card. But I misplaced the card. I also didn't think it was right for me to contact him because I was with that farm at that time. Little did I know. My elder brother and I grew up together. We loved each other so much. That everybody thought we were twins. But when it was time to marry, my brother made a mistake. He married the wrong woman. And uh, that wrong woman actually led to his untimely death. But before my brother died, the wife already had a baby. And at the time my brother died, the wife abandoned the two months old baby and went away with another man and remarried. And even before my brother married her, she already had a baby out of wedlock. I understand that baby has mental issues. But that is by the way. Because of the love my brother and I share, I decided to adopt that his child as my own child, as my first son. In his honor. That was the situation before I got married to my wife. I explained things to her and she graciously accepted my position. We both agreed to adopt Joshua here as our first child. Nobody else was aware of this decision. Everything was moving fine until he came up with his troubles. Joshua, my wife and I have given you the best any parent could do. The best any parent could do. But you messed it all up. But I want to assure you that I will continue to love you and I will continue to take care of you for the sake of my brother. But as for being my first son, no, you have lost that position permanently. You lost that position to your foolishness, to your wickedness, to your treachery. You lost it all by yourself. That is the position, Doctor. My children, that is the position. My sweetheart here, she has endured so much. Sweetheart, I am very sorry. I am sorry for all the inconvenience and the heartbreak you suffered for the sake of this incorrigible child. I thank you for your loyalty. You never, you never treated him different. Never at any point. It is rare. I love you. My children, I am sorry for imposing this wicked child on you as your senior brother. It was a decision I took in good faith, but I messed it up. I thank you so much, Doctor, for your professionalism. Thank you. You saved my family from an impending disaster. Thank you very much. And God bless you. When I think it's over When I think I've lost all Then is when God says Calm down Yes.
Yep. Uh, have it. So, what is this? A house. Yes. A five-bedroom duplex with a swimming pool at the back. For who? For our dad, of course. What? Me? No. Hey. How? You bought a house for my dad. Yes. Oh, I, I, I must be dreaming. I need to wake up. My house. Oh, I wish my wife is around to, to help me share in this joy. House. I can't believe this. Hey, hey. No. You mean you bought a house for my daddy? Yes. And they deserve more than that. I will do more, sir. Hey. My God. Daddy, do you know? Now, it's clear to me that a good name is better than any amount of money or wealth you can acquire. Finally, he agrees. Dad, God, do you know people can go to any mall to acquire money? And, God, I can't, Dad, God, you are my hero. You can say that again. Thank you. <laughs> my son. Sir. Thank you so very much. Oh, yeah. Thank you. you, you hey. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So, we are now going to live in a duplex with swimming pool. Ah. Look at <laughs> it. Look at it. Five bedroom. This is my room. Choma, look at it. This one will be my room. Choma, you stay downstairs. Mm -hmm. Good. You are selfish. Very. When I think it's over, <laughs> when I think I've lost all, that is when God
also passed. Obi now. My instinct told me that the reason you are you have played those drama that you did there is because you want to marry her, right? My instinct does not lie to me. But I want to tell you something. Oh yes, I want to I want to clear you on something you don't know. You are making one of the biggest mistakes of your life. You get married to her because she comes from a lineage of mad people. Did she tell you that there is madness in their lineage? I know, I know she did not tell you. Did she tell you about her family? The very man that wanted to marry her? And did show up that very day, right? Let me tell you something. I showed this to her family. This is the reason he didn't come that very day. Oh yes, I deny you don't know him. Eh? You want to deny you don't know Clifford? Come on, come on. The mad yeah. man. Are you crazy? My family mad? Hey, 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 hey. Go dad! No, 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 leave it, leave it. Leave it. Look at this! Leave it, just leave it. Young man, let me tell you something. I never really liked you because you never meant well. I only tolerated you because of my daughter. I didn't like you too. You just shut up! Idiot! Shut up! Look for your information. That madman, Clifford, is not our blood. Yes. His mother gave birth to him before marrying my co in law's brother. So we know exactly what Clifford's problem is. Even if he were to be our blood, there's nothing wrong in one getting sick. Just know this, that there is no madness in my family. My ancestors, no history of madness in them. Idiot! Go ahead, but you have to thank me first. You have to thank me for saving you from getting into the lineage of mad people. You just said that they have madness in their lineage. So why do you still want to marry her? Um. Well, I wanted to to help her. I wanted her to stay with my sick mother while I enjoy with my real wife abroad. So, what? So Jerry, you are still the same. So you've not changed. Huh? You were like this growing up. And you're still the same. I thought by now you must have changed. Jerry, why do you derive joy seeing people cry? Why do you derive joy seeing people shedding tears? Tell me, what are you going to benefit from all these stupid things you've done? You keep telling people you live in America, you live in UK, wherever you live here in Ghana. Huh? Ghana? Yes! Yeah. He lives in Ghana. Ghana? Ghana! Accra? I'm Obina. Keep quiet, I'm still talking. He's a criminal, he does criminal uh, Obina. in Ghana. Obina! You should be thanking yourself that you're still out. I should have put you behind bars since. Are you talking to me? Yes, that I'm talking way. to you. I mean, are you talking to I me? I am that talking way? to you. Will you listen when I'm still talking? Do you know what? You are more mentally imbalanced than the Clifford you are using to blackmail my sweetheart. Your sweetheart? You call her your sweetheart, Obina? Eh, eh. So you have paid money, right? You can now challenge me, Obina. Obina, you can. Uh, have you forgotten? Jerry! Have you, uh, have you forgotten the path? Eh? Jerry, if you don't leave this place now, you'll regret ever stepping your foot in this. Obina! Now leave. Obina! 
Hey. Are you talking to me? Get out! Get out. Obinna! I said get out! Obinna! Get out! Obinna! Get out of this place! Get out! He said to go! When I think Sorry, it's over When I think Can you Come on, Ghana, here. Lost all, Akara. That is when God hey. Come down Ghana. When I think I'm a nobody When I think my world oh my has crumbled That is when God restored me God is the hope to the hopeless. Never you cry again. He has you. Obina, please forgive me. I want you to forgive me before I die. Uh, shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Don't mention that name again. Right? I am here and you're talking about Obina. Huh? While I'm the one taking care of you, you wicked woman. Don't mention that name again, okay? You are the cause, you are the cause of my troubles. You are the cause of all my troubles. Nonsense. Don't mention that name. Okay, okay go, go, go and call him now. Eh? Go and call him to take you to the hospital. Go and call him to take care of you. Nonsense. Obin, 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 Obin. Nonsense. Nonsense. Wickedness Nonsense. does not pay, but has a way to bounce back. What? Obi, how could you break my heart with such a cruel manner? You gave me your word the other day I'd be rushed to it. I was about celebrating before you slapped me with such a gross news of my life. Oh? I never gave you my words that I was going to get married. You did. No, I didn't. Stop denying it. Stop, stop being a coward amount to it. No. I only told you I was going to think about it. What is the difference? What did you tell me? That's why you were not interested. Why didn't you? There is no way I could have gotten married to you. Because I don't want to spend the rest of my life arguing with my wife. I don't argue. You do. No, I don't. You do. And you're still doing it. I don't. Stating the fact is no argument. You're just looking for a way to hang their dog. I'm saying something. Exactly what you're still doing. We're talking. You're still arguing right now. You should have told me earlier that we're not interested other than using me and dumping me. I never used you. I never dumped you. My heart with someone else. Okay? A woman that I love so much. A woman that I cherish so much. I adore her. I respect her so much. She's the woman I want to spend the rest of my life with. The woman I want her to bear my children. Please, respect our decision, okay? See, we can still be friends. Friends my foot! You are a devil! How could you be so cruel? I loved you! I loved you! I loved you! Just, just an ingrate! Get out! Rachel, please! When I think it's over, when I think I've lost all, that is when God says, calm down. When I think I'm a nobody, when I think my world has crumbled, that is when God rest on yes. me. <laughs> yes. oh, never you lose me. Oh, God is the hope to oh, the hopeless. Yes. Never you cry again. Oh 
of you when they push you around never lose hope God knows what to do when I think I'm a nobody when I think